Gotta. And I'm like, I don't know what that means. Where's the beacon? Where are we going? I'm off the beaten path, like, very clearly, and I don't know where I'm going. I thought the end would be, like, over here somewhere. I don't... Where, 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 where were we racing? Where, where we were going? Where were we going? I have a feeling I was supposed to use these at some point. Okay, so... I went this way. They... Oh, it's... It's right there. Well, I feel stupid. Hey, guys. What's up? I didn't know where we were going. Oh, yeah. Ride the pool. 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 Oh, yeah. Want to see me flip upside down, boys? Oh, yeah. Ride the pool. Enjoying the show? That makes... A ton of sense. Why is my ship also docked here, though? How does that make sense? I'm gonna go. Does Cappy just, like, note? Well, he's with me. Who's moving my ship? Because, like, I was in the Lake Kingdom. I was, like, way the fuck over that way. And then I come here to this magical Doctor Who painting. And suddenly my ship is here. And then I'll go back through the Doctor Who painting. Do we do? We do. So yeah, I'll go back through the Doctor the Doctor Who painting. I'll kill a Goomber. And then look, my ship is back here. What do you mean? Ow! The boys are getting Okay. I thought I had to land on a thing. I just had to dive down there. I also keep forgetting that, like, whenever you're, uh... Whenever you're floating like that, you have to use this. Not this. This. We're not talking about this. Or this. We're talking about this. Oh, that, there's Tengo Kuken. There's the ramen shop that was at. Uh, I don't, don't say that. Don't stop it. Uh-uh. No. Why is that like the menu option? Why does that say that? I hate that. Mm -mm. No. Stop it. Get the. All right. No, not more of this. <laughs> why is he wearing a visor? <laughs> That's why he's wearing a visor. Hey, that's why he's wearing a visor. So we can't be captured. That's why he's wearing a visor. Uh what like a like a square shape. It's more of a square shape. Oh! Oh, good. Good uh showcase of the iron shield. Look at that iron shield. That is a wonderful looking iron shield that I can definitely see. And not this man's freakishly large ears. Not at all. Not at all. I'm glad this man's This man, his name is Iron Shield. This man is coming with me to protect me. Thank you. Also, it kind of looks like that he's not even holding up the Iron Shield because it's if I move my camera. Uh it, it's it's there. It's just it's there. So, uh, all right. I can respect the fact that you do not. Unzip the cat. Oh, baby. Unzip the chasm. I can't make jokes like that because they become too personal. I have a wife and a child. Whenever she gets something, Sorry. she calls instructions destructions. I like that. <laughs> no, it, it bothers the hell out of me. I'm like, no, D is to destroy, like, it, undo something. Oh, yeah, the D is to destroy. Yeah, so it's like, it's not destructions, <laughs> that's instruction. <laughs> uh, yeah, hey, the joke. We're here now. <laughs> I didn't realize this took me to the back here. I'm just sneaking up on her. <laughs>
Link, stop grunting. She doesn't know you're here. This is like cute inputs in uh, Dark Souls. I, I'm trying to like backflip, but I'm trying to swing at them at the same time, and I couldn't do it. The tail. Give me the Hey, so did anybody else see the yep? I uh I wanted that. So good. This is stuff. The wonderful thing about doing that particular voice is you get to leave out some words for comedy. This certainly is stuff. Mm. This, this certainly is stuff. This is one of the drinks I have drunk. Ah, oh, oh I'm, 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 uh, that's not the... <laughs> okay, first of all, I pressed ZL instead of ZR, so that was my mistake. Some reason I wasn't expecting him to just Okay. Alright. Let's uh let's try that again. Oh boy. I see you messed up that sure did! Press the wrong button. I meant Um Raise your sword to the sky, please. Alright. To the sky. To the, to the sky. To the, to the sky. Motion control. But sometimes you miss stepping your life flash before your eyes. Or, <laughs> or like you're going up the steps and you miscounted. Or like you just, you thought you were lower than you were. And you go up that one last phantom sp step and you're like... Good, there's a skip option. Oh, hi. This is a real person, too. This is like a real-life human being. Not a... Okay, we're gonna... Y'all enjoy. I'm married. This is a video. Okay, was it... Did we die? Uh... <laughs> Don't show the fucking box, dude. Don't... Don't show the fucking tissue box after that. Come on. When I heard she made it herself, man. <laughs> no way was I gonna let some scrawny clown snatch that pro Can I just... Like, this is obviously not what he was saying. But, I mean, as I was reading ahead before I, like, read it in the voice, uh... The, the phrase... Scrawny clown snatch... <laughs> It just kind of stood out to me. That's clearly not what he's he's saying. He's he's calling me a scrawny clown and saying he's not gonna let me snatch the the prize the sailcloth. But I just I just read scrawny clown snatch, and now it's just in my brain. Dude, this this is this guy is not bothered. This guy is not bothered at all. He's like, whoa, 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 welcome to our shh. I'm smacking the shit out of him. I'm sorry, dude. I uh, I forgot shaking my Wiimote. <laughs> Just not a fan of the shorts. The shorts are the only thing. Also, like, I'm I'm dressed like SpongeBob a little bit. Like, if it, just if my pants were brown. I would straight up be SpongeBob. And I'm also I also need like a blue ring around the side. But but like I f they took inspiration from SpongeBob. I'm SpongeBob. I'm just noticing this now and I can't unsee it. Please let me change my clothes later. I'm SpongeBob. <laughs> we intend to stay in one place. Do we need to go to this screen every time? I... 
Ay. Hey, guys. I know this is a remake of a 10-year-old game, but this came out in 2021. I'm not going to destroy this guy because I probably need him to for something. So I'm just going to hold off. Never mind. I can just use Henry. Oh, gosh. I have a limited time? I had a limited... Uh, hey, do I... Were, were, were one of those bottles empty, by the way? <laughs> empty, by the way. <laughs> I have a net, and I'm not afraid to use it. Big heart, coin, heart, moon, big heart, coin, heart, moon, big heart, coin, heart, moon, big heart, coin, heart, moon. Yeah. Hey, Twitch, don't ban me. I know gambling is now banned on Twitch. It's in the game. Gambling in game. I'm not using real money. In game. Don't ban me. They don't make the Mario music anymore? That was a moon? Oh, his pupils are missing. Oh, God. Hey, wait a second. I don't suppose. You don't come by here just to see me, do you? You, you know what? You are what drew me over here. Because I was like, you look bored. I'm going to go give you company. So, you know what? Yeah. Yeah, it's true. What? Really? Yeah, right. I think I'm going to fall for that old line. But... If it were true, that might be kind of nice. Oh, I almost forgot. I still have a job to do. Do you have something for me to hold on to? Not really, no. What's with you? Leave me alone if you don't want anything. Sheesh. Busy staring at a wall. You just, you literally just said, if I, if I just came over here to see you, that would be kind of nice. And then you're like, Psh. You came over here, you don't even want anything, you just want to see- Yeah! Yeah, you weirdo! Well, fine. Fine. I, I, I'll, I'll never- I've got another little jump and throw- Yeah, I, I got it. I got it. I wanna- I'm trying to figure out my controls, okay? I'm trying to fig- I'm sorry, play in VR? This game has a VR mode? That- that- yeah, you, dude, you're doing this shit in VR? That... That feels like you're... Also, shake the joy kind of throw. Can I get rid of the, the thing at the bottom? It's ruining my clips. Like, every every time I like I would go to, like, clip this right now, and I, I post it to Tic Tac, the, the freaking text is at the bottom of the screen where Mario is, and I can't, like, zoom in on him without saying throw cap beneath his face. Looks like everyone's eager to get to know you, Zach. All right, then. Who wants to be the first to ask our new friend a question? Oh, dude, this sucks. This, this would absolutely suck if you were actually in school and, like, you were a new student, which is already nerve-wracking enough, and they were like, all right, stand at the front of the class and have the entire class ask you questions about yourself, and you have to answer them. That, that is a mild form of... And I don't think that moon was for here. So I think that might be like if there's one of those that puts you in the sand kingdom. Uh that might be what that is. Where the birds gather, no freaking idea. Hey, do you think this is where the birds gather? <laughs> oh, I gotta probably hit you with that, right? No. How'd I- What? I just ran into him before and the beetle got hurt. Why did he get hurt that- Why? Please. Are you gonna- Are you gonna let me buy? No, you're not. Let's go see if I can find some seeds. Not that I think that there would be seeds in these things. But. Hey, there were seeds in those things. Alright! 
There we go. No, he's not stunned for long enough. Just kidding. Get out of here. That was stupid. Now that I've done that, Cosmic, I read that it in the chat about halfway through that. I didn't do it on purpose. Stop backseating. Let me figure things. Ah, this is about as this is about as underwhelming of a boss, and it's a Mario boss, so like I should expect it to be. But but it's about as underwhelming of a boss as the the boss of that temple that I did in Skyward Sword the other day was. That was just like, hey, slash the eyes and use the item that we just gave you. That's the boss. That was the boss. And then this one was just like, I want to give my weakness right after you. Just jump on it. Come on, round the head. Round the head. Round the head. Let's go. Round the head. Oh! Can I break his pumpkins? Bam. Bam. Now you don't have pumpkins to serve people, and you'll never know who did it because security cameras weren't invented yet. Ha ha ha. Your next job is to help pick the pumpkins. And I don't want to hear any moaning or complaint. Fine, whatever. Keena spends her afternoon picking pumpkins in the patch out bed. Carry those to the storage shed. Ke I oh. oh. I was, I'm a smashing pumpkins cover band. And, uh. Hello! At this point, uh, this is almost no different than the time that I would normally start the stream it was supposed to be uh but uh i it, it, it's not a it's not a good idea to uh have all of your things in one photoshop document that is all i'm gonna say uh if you if you can Maybe, like, separate your Photoshop documents into, like, this is the document for this part. Like, thumbnails. This is the document for the layouts. This is the document for the... Because I used to have all of my stuff in one Photoshop document. And then it takes a lot of RAM to open that document. Uh, so I have already split up all those things, but I needed something from that document. So I went to open it. With all of the stream stuff already open, and my and my computer was like, you have no RAM to do this. And then it crashed, and then it didn't save anything, so I had to redo all of the stuff that I was in the middle of working on. That didn't end up working out and looking the way that I wanted it to anyway, so it's kind of a waste of half an hour. <laughs> but here we are. We are live. It's time for more Yakuza. Yes, my title just does say I am a pirate. I forget how to pronounce the kanji for pirate. Hold on. Oop, wrong button. Uh, kanji for pirate. It started with a K. Uh, Kaizoku. That's what it is. Kaizoku. That's, that's what I have there, right? Yes. Yes, that is, that is the kanji that I have there. Kaizoku. Boku wa kaizoku da. That's what it says. What's up, shoddy? How are you? Uh, uh, have I played Infinite Craft? I have not. I have seen exactly one clip of it. I've seen one clip of Infinite Craft. It was Small Ant. Uh... And he put, uh, he put two words together and it made slavery. And he, then he put slavery together and another word and it made America. And that's the only clip I've seen of that game. Let me see, let me see if I can find that clip. Uh, not this one. This is a video. I want, I want the short. Where's the short? 
I, I, I need the short. Where is it? Does he have a different channel for shorts? Clips channel. There we go. Shorts. There we go. Where, here it is. This one. This one. Oh. Oh, it was just, it was, it was a bunch of race. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Let me, let me make this one the full screen here a second. This is the clip I was talking about. Where's the, where's, oh, where, where's the volume? Why is, why do I not have volume? Hello? Open volume mixer. Oh, because it's not outputting to the right thing. There we go. Slavery and racism made America. There it is. Racism in America. Do burger plus king. It's worth it. Trust me. Wait. Hey, hey no. right here. Here we go. Slavery. Slavery and racism made America. Racism in America made Trump. Racism oh, I forgot human. that part. Okay. Slavery? Yeah. Yeah. Wait, what did I need Slavery to and open or close? Made America. Racism in America made Trump. Racism human. What did I need Slavery? to close? Oh, that. The, people know my name, dude. It's fine. Slavery. People know my name. I don't make it much of a secret. It's fine. Uh, no, people know my last name. Uh, I don't keep that much of a secret either. I don't personally care too much. So. Yeah. All right. Well, since I started a little bit late and I want to get in as much Yakuza as I can today, let's go ahead and hop into the guest the game. I need to open up my lo-fi music, though. Let me do that as well. Also, I once again have not drank enough water today. So I'm going to be guzzling my water. For the first part of this stream. Like. Absolutely. Alright. No, 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 no. History. Where's the... There it is. Alright. Let's get into the game guessing. Arrow with the 35 months. I'm hitting the wrong button. Arrow. Welcome back to the scrapbook for 35 months. Enjoy your stay. Enjoy your in-chat sticker pack, and I hope you cherish your memories here. You are 25 now. Happy belated. If it was, if it's not today, I don't actually know when your birthday is, but you're 25 now. So happy birthday slash belated birthday. Hope you have slash had a good one. Not gonna stay. You woke up with a, uh, severe diabetic issues, which have gotten you. Okay, I hope you resolve those, Arrow, and I hope you had a great day on Saturday. And I hope that your day on Saturday did not contribute to these diabetic issues. Feel better, please. Feel better, please. Okay. Turn on the lo-fi. Let's get into it. I'm shot in the dark, dude. Shot in the dark. I really don't know. This cop, maybe? It's not Bioshock. Uh, Metacritic score 80%. You can see a little bit of the UI there. But I don't really recognize it. Several different things of dollars. You've got dollars here, dollars here, dollars here. And I think that might be a waypoint up there. But 
but I don't really recognize it. Is it... Is it the Saints Row remake? It is not. PC, PS5 series, is it... Is it Warzone 2? Do I have Warzone 2? Is it, is it just Warzone? It's not. Shooter Tactical. And you have Loadout, and it's pretty recent. At least within the last four or five years. Request Revive and Change Loadout. Request Revive makes me think it's a... It's like a team game. Like a, you squad up with your friends and play it. Which I mean, Warzone is that. What other... What other Battle Royale games have come out? It's also not a... It, it, I, maybe the genre would say BR, but it's BR. I don't even know what shooter games have come. I do not play shooters. I don't have an interest in them either. Like, sometimes guess the game makes me interested in playing the game or the shot. I have no interest in shooters. I played Black Ops when it, like, was new, and that's kind of it. Ugh. I also played PUBG uh, when that was new as well, but I, I can't even like fathom a sh another shooter that's come out in the last few years that's not in the Call of Duty franchise. <laughs> Is it... Is it a Rainbow Six game? Uh... Was there a new Rainbow Six that came out in the last... Because I feel like Rainbow Six Siege has been just the one for, like, ever. But it says tactical. I'm just gonna check if there was a Rainbow Six game that's come out in the last... Rainbow Six, what was the most recent? Rainbow Six Mobile, cool. Uh, yeah, Rainbow Six Extraction came out in 2022, but it came out for also last gen. So it's not that. I really? No freaking clue. Like, what it could be. I'm gonna, I'm gonna type Rainbow Six Extraction and see if it's in that series. It's not that. 2023. This isn't telling me anything either. Clearly, you, you like... But I, I, I don't know. Embark Studios. This does not look... at all familiar. The Finals. This could have been literally anything. This could have been literally any game. A any, like, modern shooter game that's come out in the last few years. This could have been literally anything. They all look the freaking same. All right. How about yesterday's? I feel like I should know this. This looks a little undertale-y to me, but I don't think it's that. I think it's older. I think it's- I, this might be an arcade game. My- it's not this. My first guess is that. 
Uh, it's super not that. And now this looks nothing like what I thought it was going to look like. 93. 93 on Metacritic. And it's just... Lava. There's a thing behind the Metacritic score, but I can't really see it. Uh, original platform PC? Oh, what's the... Is, is, is it... I can't spell, dude. Sure isn't what the f hell? Genre simulator. Average image seems to take me further from a guess. Exactly. Because I've never played Prison Architect. I just know you need to keep your prisoners and stuff happy. And this looked like it could have been that. But like, now I have no idea what this is. This is clearly, like, the, a similar, like, error screen, or, like, fake error screen, but I, I have no idea. Original release 2006. Yeah, I don't know. Bay 12 games. I really don't know. Dwarf Fortress. I, I don't feel like I was ever going to get anywhere close to this. Never heard of it. Never heard of it. These are getting rough. These are getting real rough. Dang it. That, that looked pop tropical to me. All right. Foster's Home for Imaginary Friends? I don't know. 83 on Metacritic. Oh, excuse me. 83 on Metacritic. And it's a very, like, flat art style. Don't know. This is not telling me any... PSP? Oh, God. These are not getting any easier this week. The only things I really remember playing on my PSP that were PSP games uh, were Grand Theft Auto Liberty City Stories, Madden 09 and uh, Ratchet and Clank Size Matters. Those were the three PSP games that I have actual recollection of ever playing. And the rest of my use of the PSP was uh, modding it and playing like GBA games on it. Like my first playthrough of Yoshi's Island was on my PSP that was emulated. Uh, and then, it was also, this, is this a little loud? I feel like the music got a little bit loud. Oops. There we go. Uh. And I mean, there are a lot of great games, like, I found out later that came out for the PSP. Unfortunately, I don't have it anymore. I also had a Vita, but the only thing I really ever used my Vita for was Netflix because it was the only thing that I had that had an OLED screen and Netflix looked real pretty on there. And I watched Supernatural on it. That That's what I remember of the PS Vita. And then I have no idea what happened to my Vita. I wanted to play uh, the Ratchet and Clank collection on the Vita. Uh in like 2013, 2014. Uh, and I could not find my Vita whenever I went to actually use it. So I don't know what happened to it. Uh, whenever you hear PSP, you, uh, you, see, you see a Sega Game Gear in your head, even though it's like 15 years older than the PSP. Uh, 
I had a PSP 3000 silver. That's what I, I, I just picture that. I, no idea. Puzzle strategy. Still, none of this looks even remotely familiar. Zero of this looks familiar. Loco Roco. I died. Nope. Zero. We're 0 for 3. 0 for 3. The Kirby. That was a Kirby knockoff? Let me look at that again. Uh, no. It looks like you use like a gyroscope thing. Yeah, that. I, I have no idea what that even would be. I can't tell if this is just a backdrop or if it's like a path. I think it's just a backdrop, but it doesn't tell me anything. The letter V six times. Sure. It's not the letter V six times. This is not rated. And it's more shapes. He would tell you like zoomed in 400% or something. Yeah, maybe like since there's no note on the first one, just like zoom level. But they don't have to. Uh, there's a box with a chain here. And then another thing. It's not rated by Metacritic. Platform mobile. I'm not gonna get it. It's a mobile game. It's a mobile game. Oh. Oh, yeah, I'm not gonna get it. I have, yeah. Yep. I've heard of Geometry Dash, but one, I've never played it. Two, I thought it was like a, like a browser flash game. So I wasn't gonna get that one either. All right, 0 for 4. We're, we're sucking this week, dude. We're sucking this week. I, I shot in the dark here. Nope. Original release too old for Metacritic. Is this a Mega Man game? Or a Castlevania game? I'm gonna say Mega Man. Uh, Mega Man 4. Sure. It's not Mega Man. DOS Amiga Atari Com... This is older than I thought it was. Also, I don't know. I don't think Mega Man 4 was too old for Metacritic. I just don't know. I, I'm not going to... Nope. Not going to know this. Rick Dangerous 2. Yep. Nope. Never heard of it. All right. Are we going to be 0 for 7 this week? Maybe. Because at least this one looks a little more modern. But even still... I have no idea. Looking at this, no clue. I don't play enough games to be good at guessing the game. <laughs> Clearly. Uh, it's snowy on a fa- I, I don't know. Batman Arkham Origins. Sure. No. Does that say ring? Ring ya? Ring ya? 87 on Metacritic. That looks like somebody with a helmet and like a... I don't- I can't tell if it's like a gun or like a handle or something. And I'm trying to read what that- that smaller middle one is, but I don't know. Motors, maybe? I have no idea. What's like a motorcycle game?
or like again any like first person shooter with a story that has had a recent entry don't know kill kill uh PC and PS5 okay then what that to me says it was a Sony exclusive that, that was later ported to the PC. Unless it was well, its original platform. PC and PS5, but not Xbox. Don't have a PS. I, I, I sure. Adventure shooter, yup. One of those. 2021. None of this is looking for looking familiar to me. Absolutely none of it looks familiar to me. Arcade. Okay, Arcade is like a studio that I hear of, but like I don't. Deathloop. Oh, okay. A lot of people were like praising this game whenever it came out. I, again, I'm not a shooter. This was a terrible week for Guess the Game for me. This was an absolutely garbage week for Guess the Game for me. It's been shooters and games that came out before I was alive that I've never heard of. Uh, four plus X, use Medikit. This? I don't think it is. Like, truthfully, but... It's not an RE game. Okay. That's just a truck stuck in the mud. That's not gonna help me. PC, PS2, and Xbox. Okay, so it's like right around the time where I would know some of these at least. Oh, okay. I, I was probably alive when Geometry Ass. Geometry Ass. Ge Geometry Dash came out, but uh, I don't play mobile games. So I wouldn't have known it. Aside from, like, just knowing the name and knowing that it was popular. Uh. Shooter. Again with the shooters, dude. Again with the shooters. I, it's a shooter. I don't know. <laughs> Sniper Elite. Yup. Again with the shooters, dude. I don't know. I'm not a shooter. Dude, I feel like if you... If you are a gamer and you don't really play a whole lot of shooters, like... Xbox and PlayStation at, in modern times, there's like a significant chunk of modern AAA games that just don't interest me. Alright. We're 0 for 7. I'm just gonna pick a random one until I get one that I know to feel better about myself. Uh, mm. Nothing from that one. That's in Russian. Pretty sure. Oh, is this... M it's not Minesweeper, is it? Ta oh, like the original Tetris. Oh, that makes sense. Okay. Now I'm mad. 
I didn't actually know a Tetris originally looked like this. That makes sense. It was 1985. I just didn't think about it. Okay, well, now I feel stupid. Guess the game has made me feel... Like I don't play enough video games to play it properly. And also real stupid today. This one's gonna make me feel smart, though. Let's go. That's Treasure Trove Cove, baby! Alright. An easy one. An easy dub for me. I'm gonna stop guess the game there today. I'm gonna stop there. Easiest dub of my life in this game. I'm just gonna stop there. That was stupid. Alright, so like... Yakuza, right? <laughs> so, like, Yakuza? Right? Yeah? I was smart this time, and I, I booted the game up before I started stream, so I didn't have to murder everyone's ears? Why was my controller disconnected? Why was my controller disconnected? There we go. That was weird. Yes, so Yakuza, right? Can I, like, delete? A slot, because it I accidentally saved it a new slot last time and it upset me. Alright, so what were we doing? Uh I think the last time the last thing that I did was I got the the bat. I can attack with the bat. I think that was the last thing that I did. Was I got the ability to attack with the bat. Oh, right, you! You're- you're a sub-story. Hey, kiddo. Where's your mom? Are you lost? Oops. No, I'm not. No? Then what you standing around for all by yourself, then, huh? No reason. What's with this kid? She's doing it right not talking to strangers, but it's dangerous here. Better send her packing. Listen, why don't you hightail it back to your mom instead of loafing around here? This ain't no place for kids. Okay. Half with you then, you little scamp. Go on. Kinda looks like she had something to say. Still, she ain't lost and ought to make it home okay. Just hope there's no troublemakers lurking about. That means there's troublemakers lurking about. Are you gonna go home, or...? Are you- are you gonna go home? Maybe if I talk to you enough? Nope. <clears throat> okay. Cat game! Oh. Card game. Never mind. Also, cat's neck. I'm an idiot. I didn't see the. Uh... Oh. Hello. Hmm. What am I gonna do? Oh, what to do? Y you. Hi. Excuse me. Huh? Uh. Uh. Well. The thing is, you want something from me, don't you? Let's hear it then. Yes, what I'm trying to say is, uh, um, you like my shoes, my snakeskin boots? Nice, right? Listen, whatever you're chewing, I can take it. Spit it out. I, I have a favor to ask. Can you? Please be my boyfriend. Oh. Depends on how old you are? D 
because you look like you are not an adult. Sub stories. Be my boyfriend. You look like you're not an adult. Say what? Am I hearing you right? I said, please be my boyfriend. Please. Pretty please. Yeah, you're definitely not an adult, and I'm, I don't like this. What, just like that? Your boyfriend? You mean, like, you want to be a couple, go on dates? What the hell? Yes, that's exactly it. That's what, that's what a boyfriend does. You would be my one, uh, one. B boyfriend. Right. Okay, back it up a step or six. What the heck's with this little lady here? Just run up to me on the street demanding that I be your man? Every girl I meet these days makes me understand him less and less. Gotta get it together. Can't let her know she got under my skin. I'll give her a strong answer. Like, don't even think you've won, little lady. <laughs> I got no interest in women. Dude. Majima the gay pirate. Let's go. Sorry, darling. I got no interest in women. Huh? Uh, oh, okay, I mean, it's not a problem at all. But if you don't mind, could you set aside your preferences and just be my boyfriend for today? What are you talking about, girly? Oh, darn it, I've left out a few details, haven't I? Just a few! Namely, your age, please? I should clarify, I guess. I needed to pretend to be my boyfriend, not actually be my boyfriend. Oh, okay. Well, oh. Excuse me? Pretend? Hi. Yes. You see, my father is visiting from back home, and he's demanded to meet my boyfriend. For several years now, he's been hounding me to meet suitors he's arranged for. He was getting so persistent that I finally got fed up, but I told him, I already have a boyfriend, so back off. I also told him my boyfriend is thin, wears an eye patch, a cool ponytail, and has a dangerous air about him. Kind of like the blade of a knife. That's oddly specific. And I very oddly specifically fit those requirements. Why would you give him so many details? And why'd she just describe me down to the buttons? I never thought I'd have to introduce him to my father, so I just kind of made it up as I went. But then Dad started saying, I have to see if this boyfriend is worthy of marrying you. So here I am, and I've got a big problem. Okay, I get the picture now. I fit the bill, so you want me to act like I'm your man in front of your dad. Wow, you catch on fast! That's pretty much it! If dad finds out I don't really have a boyfriend, he'll force me into an arranged marriage with some strange man I don't even know. Aren't I a strange man that you don't even know? Please, nobody else looks anything like you. Could you be my boyfriend for just a little while? Yeah, sure, why not? The girl's in a pickle, all right. Who'd want to marry some guy they don't even know and end up spending the rest of their life with him? Fine. You painted yourself into this corner, but I feel your pain. I'll pretend to be your boyfriend. Yes! I'm so glad I didn't lose hope. Huh? Who are you, Makoto Naegi? Oh, my name is Kokoa. Please call me Koko-chan. Oh, and sorry, I didn't catch your name. I'm Majima Goro-san. Goro Majima. I, this dude's name, all right? Like, so, traditional Japanese name, like, order, is like family name. Oh, I sorry, I did that backwards for you. Family name, and then, uh, given name, right? So, like, uh, we call him Miyamoto-san, and he is, uh, Shigeru Miyamoto. So Miyamoto is his given name. Uh, unless I'm, I, now I have to Google Miyamoto because I don't know if we call him Shigeru Miyamoto, but, uh, but the Miyamoto actually comes first when you say, I, I know how to look him up. Hold on. Never mind because it's Miyamoto Shigeru. Okay. All right, well, screw that uh, example. But, like, you get the picture. It's, uh, it's given name and then, or, sorry, uh, family name then given name, right? So, he's Goro Majima. And they're calling him Majima. But, like, in 
whenever you listen to the audio in Japanese, they're saying Majima Goro-san. So, like, is Goro his given name and they're saying his last name? Uh. And then, with Kiryu, is it Kazuma Kiryu or Kiryu Kazuma? I'm pretty sure it's Kazuma Kiryu-san. And they're, like, people call him Kiryu, which is his given name. But then people are, I, I'm confused. I don't know what to call him. I'm just gonna call him Majima. I see. Then Majima-san, I will address you as Goro-chan. Now you're, you're confusing me even more, Goko-chan. Goro-chan? We just met. That's taking things a little fast, don't you think? No, no. I know it's just pretend, but we are in a romantic relationship. We can't be so formal with each other. We have to make this believable. Uh, if you say so. Yes, I do. Well, let's not waste any more time. We should be going. Like, right now. Okay. Good. Let's go. Huh? I'm getting exhausted already. And what's this about going? Going where? Are we going to dinner? Come on, try to keep up. We're going to the restaurant where we'll meet with my dad over dinner. The three of us. We're gonna meet over dinner? I got nothing to say to your dad, Coco-chan. Make it so we meet, shake hands, and then let me go, why don't ya? Bing, bang, boom. No, no, that won't work at all. Dad won't be reassured unless I show him what kind of man my boyfriend is. We have to go now, Goro-chan. Get a move on. Damn, I don't know what I was expecting, but here we are. Here we are. So, Danny. Uh, leave us in being formal, calling them, referring to them by the last name. Okay. So, Goro chan, this is what we, well, where we'll meet my father. Is that him in the back? I only have two requests. Please don't reveal that you're just pretending to be my boyfriend and don't anger him. Similar to how you tend to call your teacher by their last name. I like that you said tend to call your teacher by their last name. Because I had a lot of teachers that preferred me call us call them by their first name. Like, uh, what was his, I don't even, I'm trying to think of what his last name was. Uh, when I was a freshman, I had, uh, a teacher for, I don't even remember what we called the class. It was like early civilizations and stuff. Uh, but we, we always called him Chad. And then, uh, one of my other government teachers, we called him Kurt. So, like, but I get what you mean. I had a lot of teachers do that, though. Oh, and don't anger him. You got it. What's all this about making him angry? Your dad get pissed off easily? Oh, no, he's just stubborn. He's not scary, though. He seems to think I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed, and he babies me more than he should. But underneath it all... He's as good a father as I could ask for. Well, I suppose it's tough to blame the guy. If I had a daughter like you, I'd be pretty worried too. You see? So if you start saying a bunch of weird stuff, he'll blow his lid and be all like, forget this guy, I'll raid your next date. So let's avoid that. No problemo. So, let's go over my boyfriend's backstory now. Oh, jeez. Excuse me, I need a backstory? We've been going out for six months. You're a dentist who likes going out on drives and watching movies. And your favorite food is the omelet rice I make, okay? Oh, what was all that now? No, don't worry, Majima. I got it. I got it. Uh, so, Majima and Kiryu is their first name, while Kazuma and Goro is their last name. That's why I said family name and given name, because first and last, like, are you speaking, like, first and last as, like, we know them in the West, or first and last, as in, like, their usage of first and last. Uh, let me think. Let me, let me see if I got this down. Uh, so he's a dentist, he likes dr going out on drives and watching movies, and he likes the omelet rice that she makes. I had to give my dad some details about my boyfriend, so I made stuff up. If he gets curious, can you make sure you've got it memorized? 
Okay, she's been two different people. She's been Makoto Naegi from Danganronpa. Uh, and she's also been, uh... Axel from Kingdom Hearts. Uh, how it is in the West. Okay. Oh, I thought... I thought it was Goro and Kiryu are their first, or their given name, and Kazuma and Majima are their last name. That's how I thought that it was. But I, now I'm just confused. I'm forever gonna be confused. Well, you ain't exactly making this a walk in the park. How am I supposed to remember all these details? Listen, I'll say them again, Majima. You're a dentist who likes going out on drives and watching movies, and your favorite food is the omelet rice that Goko-chan makes. Fine, from the top. We've been going out for six months. You're a dentist. You like going out on drives and watching movies, and you love the omelet rice I make, okay? I forgot about the six months part, but I didn't think that was what she wanted repeated. I thought that was just like, we've been going out for six months. This is what you need to know. Ah, I'll give it my best shot. There he is. Dad, over here. Goko has father. Dude doesn't super look like a dad. Then again, I don't super look like a dad. So, this is Coco chans dad. Unlike his space case of a daughter, he seems pretty buttoned up. Uh, actually, his shirt's uh, unbuttoned. Or at least his jacket is. His, it looks like he's unbuttoned up here, too. Goro-chan, this is my father. Hello, I'm Kokoa's father. Pleased to meet you. And this is the man I'm seeing, Goro Majima-san. You know, now that I think about it, meeting a girl's dad for the first time is super important for a normal couple. This could end up making an impact on the rest of her life. Guess I'd better buckle down and get into this role properly. No different than at the Grand, right? The first impression's key. What do I open with? Pleased to meet you, sir. I'm Goro Majima. I'm delighted to meet you, father. Please make my miso soup every morning. <laughs> Just I'm be normal to start off with. Pleased to meet you, sir. I'm Goro Majima. I'm not gonna call him father. That's a little too strong. And I don't even know what the heck that implies. Pleased to meet you, sir. I'm Goro Majima. Majima kun, is it? I understand my daughter looks to you for a lot of support. Support? Oh no, in fact it's quite the opposite. Gokoa-san has stood by me at every turn. Well, how courteous of you. Something that gets to me these days is the erosion of courtesy in today's youth. So many can't even man manage a proper introduction. You seem different, Majin Uh, their family name is Goro and Kazuma. Like, it helps, but I thought that it for Majima, it was the other way around. Because when they say it in Japanese, it is Majima Goro-san. So, I thought that the family name was Majima, and the given name was Goro. Which is why I'm confused here. And that's what I was confused about in the whole thing anyway. Because, like, with Kiryu, Kazuma is the family name and Kiryu is, like, his first name. Or his, uh, given name. Uh, and they write it out, Kazuma Kiryu. But with Majima, like, the way that they say it is opposite than the way that they write it. Which was what was confusing me. And then, they're saying that Say, calling him Goro is like more personal, which makes me think that everyone calls him Majima, which is his family name, and then because it's more personal, Goro is his given name. But maybe I'm wrong about that. that I'm, I'm saying I'm confused. <laughs> now, I, now I'm just, now I'm gonna I'm just gonna Google Majima. Uh. And, okay, so in Japanese, it is Majima Goro. 
So, I've got- I, I think I was correct initially, and then they made this, like... Like, they weren't consistent with their switching of the names for the English translation. Good. The first impression went well. Playing the respectful type was pretty slick move. Ajima, I must say I'm surprised. You really do exist? I beg your pardon? Well, my daughter described you as a man who is tall yet slender waisted, sports an eye patch, has long hair tied back, and emits a deadly aura not unlike a dagger's edge. I never imagined such a man could actually exist! Yet here you are in the flesh, you are hard fiddle dee dee, motherfucker! I'm here! See, Dad? I told you I wasn't lying. My boyfriend's right here in front of you. Yes, I'd figured he was another figment of your overactive imagination. So I'm really quite shocked. Aww. Overactive imagination? Dad, I don't make things up that often, do I? Ha 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 They're having a jolly good time. Huh? They do seem to be on good terms. And your dad's a decent guy, too. Stern, but decent. Oh yes, Majin Makun. Koko may have mentioned it already, but will I, what line of work you were in again? My job, huh? Oh man, I think Koko mentioned that in the backstory she gave me. Uh, I'm a dentist. I'm a Yakuza. If I say that as a joke and then say I'm a dentist, will that make endear me to him more? I don't know. Alright, let's, let's look at this. Kiryu's first name is Kazuma, which is why in the English versions of uh, the old games, he's referred to as Kazuma, Uncle Kaz, Kazi by Majima. And my old fans call him Kazuma instead of Kiryu. Majima's first name is Goro. Okay, so I'm right about Majima, but I'm wrong about Kiryu. Okay. That makes sense. Okay. So, well then let me look up Kiryu on it. Hold on. I don't want to read anything about Majima. I just want to find a place where it mentions Kiryu so I can click on it. Mention Kiryu. There we go. Okay, so yeah, his is Kiryu Kazuma. Okay. Well, that makes sense. The remakes pretty much switch it around for the English sub. Okay. So. So yeah, so I, I'm guessing when I get to Kawami and Kawami 2, they'll, like, or like anything past Yakuza 2, uh, they'll keep calling him Kazuma Kiryu. And Goro Majima. Uh. But they'll refer to him as Kiryu. And, and they'll refer to them as their last names. Or their, their family names. Always. Okay. Glad that's cleared up. Okay. Uh. I don't want to mess this up, but I, like, I have a feeling... That if I say I'm a Yakuza, then he'll be like, oh, you're joking. And then you'll be like, I'm actually a dentist. And then it'll like make me more endearing. But I'm afraid of messing this up for her. I'm a Yakuza. I'm a Yakuza. Y Yakuza? I seem to recall Coco saying you were in the medical field. Stop joking around, Goro chan. You silly. You're really a dentist, right? Ah, a joke. Yeah, see? See, a joke? Oh, uh, right. I was just playing. I got so nervous, I blurted out what I used. That's not where I thought that was going. What you used to do? Ah, no. Dr. Majima is a dentist. A dentist, remember? You said you pulled my bad tooth soon. Y yeah, I yanked that rotten tooth right out of there. I'm a cavity assassin. I, that did not go how I wanted it to. Damn it, I forgot about that. I didn't forget about the dentist bit. I just, like, I thought it'd, it'd, it'd be more endearing than what they actually scripted. 
Incidentally, Majin Makun. Yes? I was wondering, how'd you come to meet Kokoa? Oh, well that's, uh, I didn't ask you. I asked Majin Makun. But, tell me, Majin Makun, how did you two get to know each other? What the? He's prying pretty deep. Is he on to us? Gotta explain how I supposedly met Coco Chan in a way that wouldn't make him more suspicious. She stopped me in the street. We sat next to each other at a movie. Coco Chan ran into me while eating toast. I uh, she did say we, we I do enjoy movies. So I'm gonna I'm gonna go with the, I'm gonna play it safe. I'm gonna go with the thing that she mentioned. We happened to sit next to each other at a movie theater. That's how we met. At a movie? Come to think of it, Coco did mention that you enjoy movies. Yes, like I said, Coco chan just happened to sit next to me. That flick was a real tearjerker, so I offered him my handkerchief. And the rest is history. Yes, that's how it went. Amazing, Goro chan. I can't believe you came up with. I, I mean, I remember it like it was 15 minutes ago. Well, what a fortuitous meeting then. I'm just glad she didn't meet her boyfriend in any places she shouldn't be. Of course not. My Goro-chan is a proper and decent man. There. I wove in Goko-chan's backstory and came up with a tale that rings true enough. Majima-kun, I'm gonna put it to you straight. What is it about my daughter that you find attractive? Oh boy. Oh boy! The dad? Why would you put him on the spot like that? I'm sorry, Goko, but I'm just so worried about you. You're still so innocent, like a child. It keeps me awake at night, worrying about whether or not you'll ever manage to live a proper and prosperous family life. If there's a man who would love you and treat you so well, why, I would give you my blessing for a marriage right this instant. Dad, uh, that's why I need to ask, Majima Kun. What about Kokoa do you find attractive? He's looking into my soul here. Guess I can't blame him. His daughter's future's on the line. I don't like tricking him, but I told Coco chan I'd go along with this. I gotta find a good reason why I find her so attractive. She's so cute. She's- I'm not gonna go with that one. We've had enough of that in this game. She makes great omelet rice. I love her food. I fell in love with how great the omelet rice she makes is. Oh, I must agree with you there. Her omelet rice is a special quality to it. I love it too. Majimakun, if that's all you see in my daughter, I don't want to give her away to you. If it's delicious omelet rice that you want, you could just as easily marry a cook. Dad. Damn it. Tapping into Koko-chan's backstory backfired. From Dad's point of view, he'd want a guy who appreciates his daughter fully, not just for her cooking huh? ability. Oh, would you two excuse me? I need to go wash up. Uh, sure, honey. Don't fall in. <laughs> Dude, I say that every time. I, well, uh, uh, kind of. Uh, anytime somebody ne says they need to go to the bathroom, I tell them don't drown. But, yeah. Back for now, wanna learn how you're sick? Okay. Yes. Ah. Okay. Wait a sec, with her powder in her nose, it's down to just me and her old man. Damn. Awkward. Say something! Majima. Yes? I have no idea who you really are, but thank you for playing along with my daughter's li- Oh! He knows! Eh? Her lie? What lie? I got no idea what you mean. What lie? <laughs> stop pretending. I knew this was all an act from the moment I sat down. Was it that obvious? If you knew from the start, what gave us away? I could tell just by the way my daughter was acting. I wasn't her father for all these years for nothing. Then why'd you go along with this dumb charade for so long? Coco was so desperate to convince me. It's my fault she tried to stunt like this, isn't it? I'm sure it's because I kept pushing her into dates with all those suitors I'd arranged for her. You know your daughter well. You saw right through her. I lost my wife when Coco was still an infant. I raised her alone, without anyone else's help. What a man! Oops. What a man!
Oh, I gotta click on the game. What a man! I tried to raise her well, so no one would look down on her for not having a mother. But I know I've been overly protective of her. I can see now that she's capable of standing on her own two feet. I've got to stop telling my daughter to do this or do that. No more pushing her to meet potential suitors. She's her own woman. It's time I learned to let go. Good father. Maybe not originally, but like now, there you go. But the truth is, there's another reason I went along with your little charade. What's that? Someday my daughter's gonna bring a real boyfriend to meet me. And I thought this might be good practice. Yeah! Gonna go pretend you're not cuddly running to the bath. Okay. Good luck, Arrow. I'm sorry you're dealing with this. And I hope you get better. Practice, huh? Thanks to you, I got a good idea of what to expect. When the time comes, I think I'll manage. Bah. Still ain't a good feeling to spend so much time lying to someone who knew it from the start. But I gotta tell you. I think avoiding an arranged marriage wasn't the only reason Goko-chan pulled this stunt. What do you mean? I think she was trying to show you that you don't need to worry about her so much. Worry? Yeah, pretty plain to see that she's the source of a bundle of your worries. I think she wanted to reassure you that she's capable of looking after herself. She wanted to prove to you that she can manage her own affairs, like getting married. Sorry, I'm back. I hope that wasn't too awkward for you guys. Did you even break the silence? Welcome back, Goko-chan. So, listen. Your dad, your dad actually knew... Majima. Yes? Goko, you've done well finding this man. I had nothing to worry about after all. Dad. Uh -huh. I know, right? Goto-chan's a super guy. So this means you'll stop trying to set me up, right? Yes. I can see there's no longer any need. Really? Awesome! It's been an awfully long day. I'm heading back to my hotel. We haven't even ordered any food! Oh, okay. I'll walk you back, Dad. We didn't even order anything! There was no food to be had! There was a voice crack in there, though. Goro-chan, thank you so much for being my boyfriend for even just a few minutes today. Goro-chan, I think you did an excellent job pretending to be my boyfriend. Isn't your dad, like, right there? He didn't tell you that he knew. So, like, you're just saying this. <laughs> Glad to hear it. I wanted to give you this. Thank you. Five pieces of fluorite. Are you actually the dentist? Whatever the case, I think I'm free from dad hounding me to meet his suitors. What a relief. That's good. Yes, well, I have to walk my dad to his uh. hotel. Yep. When you get a real boyfriend, you better do a proper introduction so he doesn't have to worry about you. I'll try. Bye now. Coco, I forgot something. Give me just a moment. Oh, okay. Hello, Dad. Huh? Something wrong? Majima, there's one last thing I need to say. Huh? What's that? Majima, I'm glad I got to talk to you. You went through all the bother of pretending to be my daughter's boyfriend just for my sake. You're a good man. <laughs> I was trying to put one past you. Don't give me too much credit now. No, no. Not at all. That's why. I'd like it if you would be my daughter's real bo- Oh, no, I'm good. I'm good, man. I'm- We're good. I, uh... I gotta go. I'm good. I got- I got this baseball bat in my- in the back of my pants, and, uh... There's some guys after me. I'm gonna go beat the shit out of them real quick. Excuse me? What'd you just say? I said, won't you please ask my daughter out for real? Consider it for a moment. Please? What in the fresh hell makes you think that's a good idea? Cause you're the ideal man! I think I can safely entrust her future to you! Whoa, slow down. 
I'm having trouble believing my ears. That guy's eyes, like, lit up, like, scarily so. You could start by just pretending that's fine. Heck, if she won't take you. Uh-oh. I, I did say that I wasn't into women. I did say that. Did you just say what I think you did? Yeah, Dad, what's all this about? Give me a break, you two. This is why I'm single. All right. I, I, I wonder if that was a cutscene because I said I wasn't into women. All right. The gay pirate is free. All right. Oh. What's going on over here? Yay! What? <laughs> oh. Oh, they're leaving because I do. Okay. Okay, bye. See you later. All right. Well, that was... I mean, fuck you guys. Back to the pad to pass it. No, I still got some, some exploring to do. Hold on here. Oh, oh, you just moved. Hey, hey, guy, what's up? What's up? I'm here. I'm cool. Look at that guy dancing. All right, see you later. Oh. Uh, this guy seems side questy. Actually, this guy seems like he's like not. Hello? Sir? Are you okay? What are you doing? What? All right. What's in this alley? Oh, can I steal the bike? I cannot steal the bike. Oh, Holmes. It's an apartment complex. Okay. Uh, hey, buddy. Lend us some cat. Who? Oh, those guys? Hey. Hey, listen. I have a baseball bat now. You get out of here. What are you looking at? Scramble. Beat you to pull with a hat. Uh, nah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna beat the crap out of you with a baseball bat. Big words for shitlords like you. We'll make you regret not doing as you're told. All right. Yeah. Oh wait. Hold on. Hold on. Do I have enough money to like buy any slugger abilities? Uh. Yeah. All out swing. Use a unique slugging stance to unleash a monstrously powerful hit that takes down everything it touches. Let's go. I have enough for all three of these uh, starter ones. And I think like one more of the the next ones. So let's just let's just go for it. Let's just go for it. Give me power surge, give me more health, give me that one, and then what's this one? Strike out the enemy while running. Oh heck yeah. Give me that. Alright. Let's go. Oh, ow, 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 ow. Hey, 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 hey. No, 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 no. Ow! Hey. No, 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 no. Hey, 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 hey. Alright, hold on. Get out of here. Alright, I have I have no heat right now. But hold on, let me, let me hit, let me hold Y. Oh, I don't have, I need heat to do that. Okay. These guys are beating the crap out of me, and I just, one swing on I did not get much money for that at all. We're sorry. We won't cause trouble again. Promise. But those dirtbags a lesson I'll never forget. Thank you. Here's a little something for you. Uh, a slightly battered silver plate. Okay. Uh, yeah. Send the silver plate to the box. Okay. Oh, wait. Is, is that where my pad is? In here? Majima's apartment. Majima's home for the moment. Okay. Uh, there was something I wanted to do. And I can't... Oh, I wanted to... Go here. To... Uh... Use my points. Okay. What's up, boys? What's up, hooligans? Back the... Get out of here.
Okay. I got even less for that. Uh, I don't get very much for using that. I get, like, next to nothing for using that. Okay, let me go to the shrine real quick and, uh, see what I can get. Because I have a lot of points. Oh, hold on, guys. Uh, yeah, uh-huh. Let me, let me do that. Oh, uh, I got 33. Gotta go fast, gotta go fast. Card watcher. Oh, right. The money over a larger area. What do you mean, scattered money? Okay, do I have enough for like, all oh, battle. Money magnet, business. Uh, must unlock certain body cabaret, cabaret club czar first, okay. Uh, well I do want more money, so yeah. Uh, better value for your money when giving agents extra f- I don't even know what that means. Uh, but yeah, let me get all of these. Let me get a bunch of these real quick. Okay. Oh, and I don't have enough for the. I should have. I should not have done these, because that way I would have got been able to get money magnet too. Ah, whatever, man. Okay. Oh, does, does Majima just, like, become just, like, a super cabaret guy? Like, I don't just have the grand. Apparently, I'm going to get Club Sunshine at some point. Okay. Or maybe I lose the grand. I don't know. Getting away with... W oh. Hi, guys. Huh? Get real, you leech. What's all this then? Well, well, what's all this then? Screw your little sales tax. You want us to pay a tax every time we buy something? You bloodsuckers. You'll bleed the whole country dry. This is America. I understand. Your anger is justified. But it's a ne necessary evil for the sake of the nation's people. Huh? Get stuffed. You gonna pay a sales tax on that fancy suit that you're wearing, you damn bureaucrat? The tax is only made up to keep common people down. Yeah, you vulture. That younger guy sure is taking some heat over some kind of tax issue. Guess it's my lucky day to run into the son of a bitch bureaucrat trying to spring the sales tax on us. All alone in a back alley, no less. I don't like your tone, sir. I represent the voice of the general populace. And I'm here to tell you we're fucking yeah, why don't we give you a little taste of public opinion? Then you'll know what oppression feels like. This might be a good time to bring up, uh, taxes are fine as long as tax is, uh, scaled proportionately with income. But that is not the case in this country. I don't know, I don't know what, it, what it's like in Japan. But that is certainly not the case in this country. Please come. There also should be like a like a minimum that you have to make before like taxes really start. I digress. Please calm down. Violence isn't the answer. Don't do this. Uh oh, this pot's about to boil over. Uh, well, let me switch to the other style whenever I get in here, cause uh. I'm not great with the bat, and I get no money. Please, calm down. Shut it, asshole. Hey, fellas, let's tone it down. No sense in ganging up on one guy. Have a little pride, eh? The gay pirate. What? You don't know who this cockroach is, do ya? It's the pencil-pushing dickwad that came up with the sales tax. Sales tax? What, don't you watch the new- No. Not even a little bit. It's a new tax they're going to start charging next year. Wait, did sales tax actually start in Japan in 1989? Did sales tax start in Japan the same year that Taylor Swift was born? Mm. 
when did sales tax start in Japan? Yup. April 1989. Taylor Swift wasn't born for another eight months. Every time you buy something, they're going to charge you 3% more as tax. Isn't that ridiculous? Not really. What? That is some bullshit. And this guy's the douchebag? That's highway robbery. Ah! Whoa, I about lost it for a second there. <laughs> Listen, guys. I totally understand why it'd piss you off. But beating this guy to a pulp isn't going to make the sales tax go away, is it? Huh? Who gives a shit? The government needs to know what the people think of their shit policies in a way they'll understand. Direct action. Is this a little real for current world events? Yeah, power to the people. If you ain't part of the solution, you're part of the problem. You want to stick up for this big mosquito? Then we'll show you the power over the masses too. That, yeah, again, that mentality, if you're not part of the solution, you're part oh, Jesus Christ, dude. <sighs> So what you're really after is blowing off steam? Sure. See how far that gets you with me. Prepare for the revolution, asshole. Okay. Menacing man. Should it be men? Hold on, I need to I need to be a, a, a this guy. Yeah, I can help. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, get down! Yeah! Get down! Oh, can I not? There we go. The prompt wasn't appearing. Yeah, you get out of here. Bitch. Is the guy in purple just like watching me here? Get over here. Get over to the wall, dude. Hey, 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 you get over to the wall. I'm not done with you. Get in here. Bam. Cat scratch. All right, can I pick something up? Get out of here. I'm sorry. I was out of line. It won't happen again. <sighs> Public outrage sure fizzles fast. I know. Thank you for stepping in. Those people were out for blood. I'm Tayo Matsusato. Tayo, as in the sun. If I may, can I buy you a drink as thanks? Gay Pyra, let's see where this goes. That's a good name. I'm Majima. No need for any thanks, though. Yeah. Oh no, I absolutely insist. Sounds like you got your work cut out for you, though. You some kind of political big shot? Well, I don't have much in the way of rank or power, but I am in a position to help steer the country. I came to Sultan Bodhi for a conference conference on taxation policy, but I wasn't prepared to face the public about it. You're driving a tank called the government. Even if you're careful, people are gonna be pissed when you steamroll them. Ain't that the truth? We are trying to make this country a better place to live, right? You gotta take some pride in that. Do you think so? I knew people would be unhappy with the new tax, but only on a logical level. When I saw how emotional they got about it, well, it was daunting. Yeah, yeah, hey, he, j j just a little bit of a tip. Human beings, just like as a general rule, have a very hard time separating like, their issues of things on a logical level versus an emotional level. And a lot, and I mean a lot of discourse that you see about politics, is that. Is that, like, on a logical level, they're not thinking. They're thinking on the emotional level. And that's all I'll say. That being said, I need to clarify that, like, if your logical level is that p 
people don't deserve to live how they want to live as long as they aren't harming anybody else, uh, then there's, there's nothing that can be done about that. You're just kind of a dick. They find out that the sales tax is only the tip of the iceberg to th uh, and that there are more taxes on the way? I hate to think how the people will react. What? More taxes on top of the sales tax? Right, nothing's set in stone yet, but we're considering many more effective ways of generating revenue streams. Can those taxes be on like the 1% please? In fact, at tomorrow's conference, I have to give a talk on some of those proposals. <laughs> That's so. Uh, well, guess with everyone making such good money these days, you can't fault the government for wanting to get their hands on the pie. Yes, but as you've seen firsthand, we have to consider public opinion. I wonder if I can really come up with a tax policy that everyone could look. Dude, is, is this side quest coming up with Japan's tax po current tax policy that they introduced in the in late 80s, early 90s? Because, like, I don't know nothing about that. <laughs> good luck with that. Even if they're throwing cash into the fireplace, nobody wants the government to hold out its hand. <sighs> yeah, that's where I'm stuck. I haven't found the right balance, and I'm a little lost at the moment. Well, I can't say I understand a lick of what you're trying to do, but take care of the country for us, all right? Hey. Wait! Majima-san, can you help me just once more? Huh? Got another mob waiting to string you up? Oh, no, not that. I want to get your views on taxation. Oh, boy! I'm pretty sure I just made them clear. What? I know less than nothing on the subject of taxes. That's why you're perfect. You see, I just had this idea. Perhaps someone who is completely ignorant of taxation can offer an entirely different perspective. You think? Please, Majima-san. It's no exaggeration. The fate of this country rests on your shoulders. Will you please give me advice on taxation policy? What do I have to lose? <sighs> Okay, okay, you win. Let's talk some taxes. Thank you. Your insight will be invaluable. But this is hardly a place for it. Can we go somewhere more appropriate? Like where? He said he wanted to buy me a drink, so like... Now you better keep in mind, I don't know the first thing about tax policy. Don't expect much from me. I don't know how Japan's taxes work, so... Oh. No, that's exactly why I asked you. I know you'll have some unique insights, not bound by typical conventions. So you're basically hoping to strike gold in the copper mine? Well, let's just make sure you're not completely in the dark with a basic question. All right, sure. Majima-san, do you know why the government collects taxes from the people? Uh, to provide public services. That is what they should be used for. Are they being used for that in 2024 in the United States? Absolutely not. It's for providing public services, right? Hmm. Yes, that's exactly right. Sorry for asking such a basic question. Just as you said, Majima-san, taxes are collected mainly for, for providing public services. Okay, I shouldn't say that they're not used for that, but they are not used for that effectively. Education, medical care, the police, fire departments, and so much more are paid for by taxes. Disproportionately on that third one. They pay for services that the people need to survive. Yeah, we gotta build roads and bridges and keep them in working order, right? But there's more to it than that. Hi. Exactly. They also serve other purposes as it pertains to general, general wealth, but we don't need to go into that much detail. Like I said, there's a whole lot I don't know. <laughs> Oh, but aren't you interested in where your money goes? It's always good to know more about taxes. I would agree with that. Yeah, I'm getting a proper schooling here. Okay, let's shift to the main theme. Majima-san, if you were in the position of collecting taxes from the people, what would you tax? Uh, adult entertainment, tobacco, or Sato-san? Who is Sato-san? Oh, 
Okay. Got it. It's a very common family name, so he's just like yeah, everyone. Uh Well, both of these aren't bad answers. Because like taxation on like unnecessary potentially harmful things. I mean, actually that that's kind of like because, like, I always said that, like, weed should be legal and taxed so that, like, people who want to do it can do it and it helps fund, like, public services and stuff like that. Uh, but, like, I, I worded that wrong just now. Like, because it, it wouldn't be kind of fucked up if I just said, like, things that are detrimental for your health should be heavily taxed. Uh... Not as a deterrent for doing them, but because the government knows that people do do them, and they can rely on that for a stable sense of income. That's a little bit fucked up, but, like, it's true. Uh, <laughs> I would say tobacco, actually. Why not charge taxes on tobacco? Tobacco, you say? Interesting. Since the government monopoly on tobacco products ended three years ago, there actually has been a small tax on tobacco products. Yeah, I smoke myself, so I don't really want to pay a tax on them, but I suppose they're non-essential. Yeah, that, that, that's what I was, that's where we were getting at. Adult entertainment probably would have been another one, too. And if you're going to jack up taxes, it's the non-essential stuff that you start with. People might even be more likely to understand a tax on smokes, right? I see. A tobacco tax. Yeah. A pack's around 200, yeah. Uh, 200 now. People will bitch and moan, but I think they'll still fork over 300. I see. Interesting. At the 400 mark, though, I think I'd have a long, hard thing about each pack being worth. <laughs> yes, I think at that point I'd consider cutting back on my intake, too. And what about 500 a pack? I'd probably quit cold turkey. You'd quit at 500? But if we raise it incrementally- No, 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 no. Huh? Huh? He started muttering all of a sudden. That also gets into another thing that, like, I don't fully, fully, like, have a grasp on. Like, obviously inflation is a th I didn't. I, I did not think we were going to get into the nitty-gritty of tax policy when I started this stream. Uh, but, like, obviously inflation is a thing. Uh, so, like... Are taxes, like, do taxes move with inflation because taxes, at least income tax, is, uh, or uh, most taxes, honestly, are a percentage rather than, like, a fixed amount? That, that's probably a dumb question because, like, most taxes that I can think of are a percentage which would scale with inflation. However, uh, inflation and cost of living have not scaled with each other. Uh, so... What else do you think would have a potential for taxation? I think something that's closest tied to everyday living would be would have the best potential. A tax tied to everyday living, huh? Pretty shrewd. Air, pets, or gasoline? Uh... Obviously, gasoline is the answer here. How about jacking up the tax on gasoline? Ah, gasoline tax? Yeah. Why not? People with cars are obviously living it up here. Why not skim a little more off the top? The price of gas is depending on the cost of petroleum, so people have experienced price hikes before. We should be used to a price creep, actually. Not wrong. Just like... Maybe not, I don't know what the, the equivalent in yen would be, but maybe not like $4 a gallon. Keep it like, eh, mid to high twos, maybe low threes. There's also a provisional tariff on gas tax. Yes, there's really room to raise taxes without too much notice. Oh. Hey, why all the muttering? You're not feeling that one either? 
this gets into a thing that I very strongly believe in. That clearly this guy does not because he keeps muttering things. Uh, transparency. Transparency is vital to getting people to be okay with things that they might not entirely agree with happening. Uh, because if, and like true transparency in like the true reason, uh, like if I were to say, and, and like, this is a thing in the coffee industry, which is where my strong opinion on it comes from. Uh, if, if I were to like say, Hey, that bag of coffee that you're paying $15 a bag for we're now going to be charging $20 a bag for it. But it's not because we're increasing our profit margins on that bag of coffee. It's because in order to... Uh, it's because we want to pay for the green pre-roasted coffee that we get from the farmer. We want to give them a better price for that so that they get fairly compensated for their work. While still retaining the profit margins that we had previously. Like, if somebody disagrees with that, and you also have to have, like, a back, uh, like, some prior knowledge of knowing that coffee farmers are not paid nearly, nearly enough of what they should be. And when people say, like, you pay market price or <coughs> slightly above, <coughs> even if it's slightly above, market price is crap for that stuff so like paying them better and then uh while still being able to retain the business like if you say that people are more likely to be okay with that price hike rather than just being like we're charging more deal with it we won't tell you why because then people are going to assume the worst and assume like profit margins and corporate greed and stuff like that. That's a very basic explanation of what I mean. But this guy's not doing that. He's being like, all right, well, they're not going to notice it that much. And we can, like, increase it more. Yeah. Oh, no, far from it. I think it's a fantastic idea. I will definitely follow up on it. Oh, good to hear. Majima-san, anything else? Do you have anything else to say on the matter of taxation? Can I, like, type a paragraph? Anything else about taxation? Hmm. Oh, yeah. Right. Well, I was thinking about that sales tax those group balls were all riled up about. Yes? So next year, we're going to start paying 3% on top of everything we buy, right? Yes, that's how it works. Well, why stop at 3%? Sure, you can go in at that rate, but wouldn't you get more if you bumped it up? That would be impossible! Majima-san, you saw what happened. Just a 3% tax caused so much outrage, people wanted to tear me apart. To charge more would probably end up in open revolt. Yeah. No, no, Tayo-chan. You ain't thinking. People are pissed because you sprang a new thing on them, and you had to turtle up. You gotta think about the long game. The long game? Familiarity is a scary thing, my friend. Sure. People are bitching and moaning about this shiny new tax, but once it becomes a regular part of life, they'll move on to the next thing to bitch and moan about. That's also true. And that's when you start gradually turning the screws. Huh? Every time you hike it up a little, you'll get some more blubbering, but they won't be screaming bloody murder like the first time you introduced the tax. Wanna know why? Cause they'll be used to getting screwed. If something they've already accepted gets a little worse, it's just the facts of life doing what they do. But you do. So if you want to pull in the cash, you got to have a plan to really amp up that sales tax. Majima, I don't... You're not wrong. But I don't necessarily agree that that's the right thing to do. I think the right thing to do would be... If, if that was the thing that you were going to do, for, like, it to be mandatory to, for each government, I don't know how to word this, 
Not agency. Like... Like, I guess, like, local governments, like, town, and then, like, state. And, like, like every level of government to publish, like, here's what we use these taxes for in these proportions. And, like, have... Democratic say. Have the people have a say in that. Rather than the federal government being just like, yeah, like 90% of your taxes went to giving the police a new tank or whatever. Hajima-san, I'm getting goosebumps. And I think you're terrifying, actually. Are you even of this earth? What, what, what was this guy saying? <laughs> you really want to know? N no! Not really. Then, if the sales tax were to be raised, how high do you think it should go? Well, I'm in Pennsylvania. We pay 6%. Like, on everything. We're starting at 3%, right? Let me see here. Fucking 50%. I would just... What, I, now I'm curious. This is making me curious, and I'm also looking things up on my phone so that the game keeps going. Uh... What is the highest state sales tax? Uh, 7.25 is in California. What is Jap Japan's current sales tax? Uh... Oh, 10% on all items except food, drinks, and newspaper subscriptions, for which it's 8%. Interesting. Uh, then I would say 8%. Fair. Say around 8%? I see, 8%. Actually, that's a good number. It's neither too close nor too far from the double-digit 10% threshold. There would be dissent among the people, but I imagine it could actually be workable. Speaking in 2024... Which is... 35 years since then. Yeah! Yeah, but an 8% tail sacks will bump up a... 100 yen thing to 108. That would sure hurt my enthusiasm for buying pricey stuff. Maybe people went from the initial 3% up to 5, waited a little longer, and then hiked it up to the proposed 8, then eventually we'd... Enough with the moderate out of your breath, Tayo-chan. Oh! Sorry, I was lost in my thoughts. Majima-san, I'm so glad I took the time to speak with you. You're a wealth of ideas. Yeah? Glad I was useful. Useful doesn't even begin to describe it. Please, take this. It's just a token of my thanks. Primeval spirit sto- What is this guy? Okay, I better get going. I need to get back to the hotel and prepare my presentation for the tax conference tomorrow. boy. Do your country proud, you hear? Will do, Majima-san. I'll be sure to work in your advice. See ya. Was that actually the guy's name? Who, like, introduced sales tax in Japan? Is that, like, actually the guy's name? What is this guy's name? Can I give his name? Can I get his name? Matsuzato. No, he's not a real guy. That'd be interesting if he was a real guy. Never forget I'd be in a position to give a guy in the business of running our country advice. Dayo chan seemed to get a handle on uh Oh I guess it, I, I maybe it's uh Taiyo. Because I'm like running together like Tai, but it, it's probably Taiyo. Taiyo chan seems to get a handle seems Seemed to get a handle on how to go about jacking up taxes, too. Good for him. Wait. Jacking up taxes? Did I just... If taxes go up, is it my fault? Nah. 
No way. You forgot to say, like, make it proportional to how much income you have. But whatever. Okay. Oh, uh, well, my apartment's there, but... Also, some other stuff I wanted to do. Like... Oh, right! Like, like, kind of one of the main things that... Where's the, where's the Odyssey, by the way? Was it, like, down here? One of the main things that I wanted to do is I wanted to go back to the Odyssey and be like, Hey, what's up with that dude in his underwear humping the air? But I need to find where the Odyssey is. And I'm, like, uh... Okay, that's not it. Oh, clear a path! Wait, this is where I came from. Where did this come? I'm, I'm just walking into sub stories. Hey, be careful! You can't barrel through a crowd like that. Uh, I'm so sorry. I'm in a hurry. It's fine. What's the big rush? I have to go to the convenience store. The one over there. Sure? You got a real problems if you need to get, hit a convenience store that Hi. bad. Yes! I have to get some lip balm right away! Seriously? Yes, lip balm! I'm in a hurry, so I have to run! Bye! <laughs> Ugh. Hey, what's up? Are you in some sort of pain? Oh, yeah. My feet have been sore ever since this morning. Then why don't you slow down a bit and go easy on yourself? Because if I don't run, I won't make it in time. This is getting real cryptic. What do you mean? Transparency. I'm sorry, I really have to get going. Bye! Must be a real emergency to be that kind of, on that kind of tear for a lip balm. Maybe his lips are like sandpaper or something. He needs to drink more water! And maybe also, like, get a humidifier for his house in the winter time. Alright, where's the Odyssey? That's not the Odyssey. Is this the. That, that's not the Odyssey. That, it was already there. Where's the Odyssey? Am I even in the right, like, uh, alley? Was it, like, down here? Well, that's the convenience store that guy was running to. Uh, yeah, we're not doing that again. Was it over here? I thought it was in this alley. Hello, shirtless man. What's going on? Okay. Hello, sir. Are you drunk? Drunkards. There's just one. Could you? Oh, I, I didn't mean to choke him. I meant to just... I meant to, like, push him against the wall, but he wouldn't fall down. Okay, well, there's a convenience store. Uh, I thought the Odyssey was on this strip, but maybe not. He's fine. And I'm gonna be honest, I haven't seen a sign that has said Odyssey. Unless... Is that it? I don't know. I want to know what was up with the with the humpy guy. Yeah, it's not this. I, I, like, whenever I stopped in front of it to. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I, these guys are after me. The goons. Hey, haven't I told you to go jack off somewhere else enough? Oh, I, I wanted to... Okay, I, can't, I kicked that guy in the nuts. Oh. oh I'm gonna take out Honda. No more cars. Okay. 
Maybe I'll see him more later. Cause like I haven't I haven't seen him. Oh sorry, dude. Uh, maybe I'll see that guy more later. Okay, could you guys, like, fuck off? Can't find me in here. Oh, they know where I am. Can't find me in here. Just kidding. Yeah, that's right. Get over here. Go they're back. It's the same goons. Oh, I'm beating up Miyamoto in the eight. Okay. Ow. Hey, you get out of here. Hey, hey, Shiggy. Hey, Shiggy. How did I miss both of them? Yeah. Get out of here, Shiggy. Bam. All right. I, while I appreciate your pants, sir, I gotta get you out of here. Get out of here. Just scratch your face, I think. Bye, Takada. John Cena. Oh, uh, well, no, that guy, that guy's name is Miyamoto. What are you doing over here, Miyamoto? What are you doing in Osaka? Thought you were supposed to be in Kyoto. Okay. I could do that side quest with... No, 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 no. Who, who's saying that? No, 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 no. Hey, boys, you get out of here. Don't like that. Uh-uh. No, 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 no. Oh, it's the goons again. I'm hitting Y to do the thing. Hey. Get out of here. Oh, that's just, that's just his own Numa. I was like, I saw Miyamoto, now I'm seeing out Numa? What were y'all doing in the 80s? Get out. Get out. Real sorry, sir. We won't be causing any trouble again. Uh, a slightly battered old stun gun. Heck yeah. Can stun people now. Oh. Tobacco. Okay. Hello, sir. You just hanging out in this corner? Okay, cool. I just ran into Pete. He didn't seem very nice. So Takushi over here. Oh, hi guys. Who are you? Bikers. Okay. Get out of here. Get out of here. Lake Irie? He's dead. Oh, I don't- oh. That's not the guy I was meant to hit. Psh, I just kicked him. Not even like a heart, I was just like, eh. He's down. Get out of here, bikers. What's the, uh, what's this? Oh, that's the karaoke bar, let's go. I- I could go for 24 hours Cinderella again. I really could. What? My daughter, please, let my Iori go. Eh? What's all this? Let her go. Your daughter is with us of her own free will. Your accusations have no merit. You people do my daughter into joining. You, you, fanatics. If you persist in your venomous blasphemy, I'm afraid that Sister Iori will have to serve atonement for the sins of the mother. Uh, atonement? Our adherence to pacifism makes us the use of physical atonement distasteful. 
but is at times a necessary evil. Now, would you please let us be? What's going on here? Iori, what am I going to do? I don't know, see, I'm gonna go sing. No, no, sing. Yeah. 24 hour Cinderella, here we go. Let's do this, dude. Let's do this. Oh, uh, absolutely. Let's go. I, that was not in time to the thing. Here we go, baby. That, that one, in like, the, the, just before the end of the chorus, like, not, uh, uh, not Kimi wa ho ho emu, uh, the, before that, two lines before that, that was not in time to the music, because I was pressing the buttons in time to the music, and it was like, oh, you pressed that a little early, and they're like, this one's a lot, well, I don't know what, part of it's to the drum, like, at the very end of that, so, like, Maybe it was to a different part of the music that it wasn't. Th that was weird. That was weird. That was where my fast bat, my five bads came from. I can't say five bads. All right, we got our twenty-four hour Cinderella in there. Is there anything like important going on at this karaoke bar besides twenty-four hour Cinderella, which very well may be my favorite song here now? Oh, wait, no, I didn't want to do that again. I just saw, like, a little important thing beside it. All right. Now let's go see what was going on with that cult or whatever. And then, we'll, okay, we'll do this cult. Wait, there's a park here. Why do I get the feeling that... Are you selling? Oh, that's a bike. Thought that was... A, guys! Come on! Yeah, get get out. Get out. All right. Ow, I thought I was trying to grab him. Get out. Get out of here, dude. Get out of here. All right, hold on. I think this is another little sub story thing. These two talking right here. The the mom and dot. The yeah, this is another sub story thing. I want to play some more. Ready to go home? Ready to go home soon? I want to play some more. Ready to go home soon? I want to play some more. Okay, I get. I guess that's not a. a th Hello? 
Oh, uh, well, he should be ready to go home because I'm pretty sure all the drunks and uh, homeless people are going to start showing up here soon. Hold on, what's this guy selling? Nothing, he's closed. I don't know that kanji. Are you that boy's dad? Why are you looking at him? I don't... You are not this boy's dad. Not this boy's dad. Let me beat the shit out of this guy already. Immediately want to beat the shit out of this guy. Man with a stranger's face. Alright. Arthur meme! Excuse me, can you throw me my ball please? Sure, got it. Oh no. Wait, please. Huh? huh? Th that ball. May no. No, you may not. Huh? huh? What? Can I have my ball, please? Yeah, coming right up. Here goes. Huh? Whoa. Thank you. He didn't. They didn't show him throwing the ball or catching it. I did. Okay. Uh, what's with this weirdo? Got pretty dejected all of a sudden. Maybe he is the kid's father, and like, she. I, I'm. Oh wait, wait. Hold on. There's a. There's a porn card here. Now Mizuki. She looks like, like maybe the, the like older type. Uh, I okay. All right, but before we even get into this backstory or this side story, uh, I'm going to assume that uh, she's obviously this boy's mother. He doesn't know his father. These two hooked up one time, and he was the result. And, uh, the boy does not know that this is his father, and he's not actually a creep, but she doesn't want her son to have anything to do with his father. Let's find out. No. Hey, what's got you down in the dumps? Did you want to throw the ball or something? Yes, very much so. Surely you don't need to be that despondent over it. You're making me feel all guilty over here. I, I just wish I could have played catch with him, even if it were just that one throw. Why him? Thank you for being so kind. Thanks for getting my ball! Uh-huh. You keep at it, kid, and you'll be in the pros. Bye-bye, <laughs> misters! Bye-bye. I ain't old enough to be a mister. What's the matter? Why are those two f uh, so fascinating to you? You have nothing to do with this. Maybe it wouldn't hurt to tell you. Those two? They're my wife and s- Oh. Okay. L I, I, I'm feeling like I got it. But also, I wasn't expecting wife. I was just expecting he's my son and like, yeah. Huh? What are you talking about? You were obviously just a random guy to both of them. It's because my wife and son can't recognize me. What? How is that possible? Six months ago, my face was surgically altered. Okay, this did not go where I thought it was going. Surgically altered? What for? I can't get into details, but it was Yakuza related. A little bit of trouble. A little bit? Not so sure about that. The real me is officially dead. Now, I live as Keigo Akatani. Uh, with a new face and identity. So you were forced to assume another life. What's your real name? The man I was is now dead. Akatani is my real name now. I'm sorry. That's complicated. 
Just imagining it, I can tell you went through a hell of an ordeal. Yes. At first, it was a shock every time I saw this stranger's face in the mirror. There's no one in the world who can recognize me for who I was. That realization made me want to kill myself. I fought the urge a long time. But then I remembered my family. That mom and boy. Yes, but I'm a total stranger to them now. The best I can do is watch them from afar like you saw me do. Can't you just tell your wife and son about what happened and go back to them? If only I could do that. The real me is supposed to be dead. I doubt they would believe my outlandish story. Even if I could convince them, I don't know if they could accept me with a stranger's face. They probably can. I don't know if you're, like, allowed to do that if it was Yakuza related. Besides, I'm deep in the underworld. Deep enough to attract the kind of trouble that makes a man change his face. Just by being around me, those two could be in danger. It's better that I just watch them from a distance. Gotcha. Man, now I'm really sorry I threw that ball back to your boy. Please don't worry about it. I'll wait for another opportunity. It's gotta be tough for you. Take care, huh? Thank you. You're the first person I spoke with truthfully since my face was altered. If you don't mind, may I ask your name? It's Majima. It would be nice if I could chat with you again sometime, Majima-san. Well, I should be going. That's not all that was, right? Alright, I'm assuming that... That's like a quest line that carries forward. Or like a side story that carries forward. Uh, for some time. Uh, where was the... The old woman? With the... Okay, it's not here. Where was the old woman? With the, uh... With the, the cult? People? Wait, 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 who's... Oh, it's them. Hello, boys. Uh-huh. Intervene. Get out of here. Bikers. Get out of here. That guy tried and he just could not touch me. Matsushima. What if I beat the crap out of you with a bike? Or I just flipped you over these bikes. Oh, okay. Nope. Get out of here. I want to pick up the bike. And then mash it over your head. Get out. Bam. Alright, give me a plate or whatever you're going to give me. Oh, yep, a platinum plate. There it is. Alright. I might need a takoyaki break. Hold on. Oh. Yes. Oh, I got it. Okay. How was I at full health? I, I got the crap beat out of me at some point. Oh, wait, no, that guy's here. Hey, a toilet. Do I gotta drain the tank? I am just walking into these sub stories, dude. But, uh, hey, speaking of, I, I kind of do have to drain the tank. So, uh, be right back. Enjoy the clips. Some new ones in there. Zach? All right, then. Who wants to be the first to ask our new friend a question? Oh, dude, this sucks. This this would absolutely suck if you were actually in school and, like, you were a new student, which is already nerve-wracking enough. And they were like, all right, stand at the front of the class and have the entire class ask you questions about yourself and you have to answer them. That, that is a mild form of torture. How big are you? That big, huh? I know that you're not from this gen, you little koala monster. But you are so freaking cute. You get over here. Komala? Komala Harris! Oh, Miss Vice President. Great to meet ya. you. You're very light, so I don't think this will kill you. 
Yes, it will. I just killed Madam Vice President. I just killed Madam Vice President. Okay, nobody saw that. Nobody saw that. Don't, don't clip this. Don't. TikTok seems to think that, like, I hated the whole trailer just because I made fun of Chris Pratt's voice in it. That is absolutely not the case. Here, let me, let me address it. Hey, TikTok, I loved the Mario movie trailer. I think that this movie is going to be fantastic, for one. Number two, I have seen the Super Mario Brothers Super Show. I was watching that shit when you were still in your dad's ball sack. I know that voice, but that voice was from before we had 25 years of Charles Martin going, woohoo, yippee, yaha, and that's what the voice has become. Number three, Chris Pratt literally did an interview that was like, man, I've been working hard on this voice. I've been working with the casting directors and the movie directors and Miyamoto, and I think I've really landed on something. I think I nailed it, and I think I'm going to bring something to this role that you have never seen in the Mario universe before. Those were his literal words, and then guess what we got? Mushroom Kingdom! Okay, I guess that's how I can ascend, sort of. No, I'm, I'm going down, dude. I'm going down. I'm going beneath the cl I can't see anything. I am terrible at this. Wait, I can't. <laughs> this is what my brain feels like. This is your brain on drugs. I just want to go up. Where's the... Where am I supposed to be going? Okay, all right. I just want to ascend. Well, that's a huge relief. I don't know about you, but you're not... <laughs> Uh, does he? Does he look like he's flying great? I don't think so. I don't- I don't share that same sentiment, Zelda. I'm sorry. I j I don't think- I don't think that's true. I don't think you- When I heard she made it herself, man. <laughs> no way was I gonna let some scrawny clown snatch that pro- Can I just- Like, this is obviously not- what he was saying, but I mean, as I was reading ahead before I like read it in the voice, uh, the the phrase "scrawny clown snatch" <laughs> just kind of stood out to me. That's clearly not what he's he's saying. He's he's calling me a scrawny clown and saying he's not gonna let me snatch the the prize the sailcloth. But I just. I just read Scrawny Clown Snatch. And now it's just in my brain. Let's go! Oh, I didn't even- he was gonna- I didn't actually know he was gonna say that. Okay! I've got another little jump and throw- yeah, I, I wanna- I'm trying to- That was weird. That was weird. Uh, yes, Majima, I, I did have to go drain the tank. Uh, remember, whenever you go to the bathroom, doesn't matter who you are, doesn't matter what you did in there, wash your hands. It's just sanitary. Also, kind of fitting that, uh, also kind of sad, uh, if you think about that guy's perspective, how, uh, he was talking about, like, not being able to, uh, to interact with his wife and son because of the whole Yakuza thing. Uh, and then I went upstairs and immediately saw both my wife and my son, and my son followed me into the bathroom. As he often does. Anyway. Uh, the way that I think that that whole story, now that I know what it is, uh, is gonna play out, is I think Majima's going to tell him to, like, I guess, like, reintroduce himself as this new person to his wife and son, and maybe, like, become his stepfather and her second husband. That's where I think that one's going. Anyway, Majima has to drain the tank. Better now than later.
Well, this toilet ain't exactly the model of cleanliness. The walls are covered with graffiti. Most of it gutter talk at best. Pretty sorry state of affairs. Huh? Some of this graffiti is done up in some real pretty handwriting. I'm very lonely. Please reply. Heart. I can't. Listen, if you see... If you see, like, graffiti like that in a dirty, nasty public bathroom, do not interact. Only a lady has handwriting this pretty. Who could have wrote this? And what should I do? I mean, we gotta do it, right? Like, like my advice came for, like, real life, but this is a video game, and I just... I wonder what this means. I'll chat with you if you want. There. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. We'll see where that leads. I must be nuts reply to some bathroom graffiti. Yeah, I sure are. All right, so that man's chilling here. I thought they left. That kid's back. Hello, Majima-san. Spying on your family from afar like usual, I see. Don't seem to see your wife anywhere, though. Yes, I think she's at her part-time job. Then why is the kid here? Okay. Your little boy. What's his name? It's Yusuke. Little Yusuke-kun looks bored being by himself. Oh. Akatani. Why don't you go play with you, Skekun? Mm, that's not exactly great advice, Majima. He doesn't know him. And that, by that, I mean Yusuke doesn't know uh, Akatani as Akatani. It, yeah. Yeah, yeah that's... Mm. I mean, in context? Yeah, it makes sense. But, 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 mm. Huh? But, who cares about your face? It shouldn't matter if you play with him as a total stranger. Yeah, that's the problem. Don't play with you yeah, as a total stranger. That might be true, but... Nah, for crying out loud. Come on, man. Go, I'll go with you. Let's go. Yeah. Majima-san, wait. Guy who's really cold, standing by the traffic cones. All by himself, just... Chill it out. Wait. Huh? Hi, misters. What's up? Damn it. I ran up to this kid, but now what? What do I say to him? Hey, Yusuke-kun! You ever watch Achievement Hunter? You ever, uh... You, do, you, do you know who Ray Narvaez Jr. is? Uh... You do? I mean, you're about that demographic. Maybe a little younger, but yeah, you, you, whatever. Hey, uh... <laughs> hey, Yusuke-kun! Let's play! Want some candy? I don't like that one. Hey, Yusuke-kun, come play with- uh, Wait, f how- how would I know his name? I didn't think about that. I was making the joke. Huh? How do you know my name? Oh, uh, well, cuz... I heard it from this guy here. Him? But... Who are you? <laughs> this is bad, Majima-san. I've never had anything to do with the boy in my current identity. Well, that's right. Got careless. Sorry, sorry, my mistake. I just got it into my head, you look like a Yusuke. That's- that- that kid has that look on his face. Aw, oh, crap. Yusuke-kun's looking all suspicious now. Yusuke-kun, was it? What are you up to? I was watching these ants. Is that fun? Not really. <sighs> the heck? Yusuke-kun, 
Do you play at this park a lot? Oh. Yup! With my mom if she's not working, and by myself if mom has to work. When my dad was here, he used to play with me, but he's gone now. Yusuke-kun, do you miss your dad? Oh. Sure I miss him. But if I say that, my mom gets sad and lonely too. So I don't say I'm sad anymore. Wow, you're a strong boy, Yusuke-kun. <laughs> Would it be okay if us old guys joined you? So we can watch these ants together? Oh. Sure, let's do that. Thank you. He's this kid's father, all right. Oh, it's how to deal with this kid. I messed that up for the joke, dude. I have to go home now. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. See ya. Thank you, Majima-san. You made it possible for me to spend some time with my son. Yeah. I was thinking maybe I forced it a little too much. Ha! You might be right. But thanks to you, I got to be with my son. I couldn't be any happier. I have to be going, too. Akatani's got work to do. See ya, Majima-san. And then I'm gonna leave and come back and he's magically gonna be back here again. Akatani sure seemed happy. Makes sense, finally getting to talk to his son again. Hey, you got some business with him? Mm -hmm. I'm gonna follow you! What's with them? They're the Yakuza that mean that he can what? Are you dumb? Majima! They're from whatever family or clan or whatever you want to say that uh, made him change his face. Also, where, I, that wasn't even the one I wanted to do again. Where's the old woman? Is she over here? There you are. Iori, what are you going to do? Oi! I couldn't help but overhear you giving lip to those pajama-clad screwballs. Something up? Pardon me? And you are? Nobody special. Like I said, sound like an argument, and I want to make sure you weren't in any danger. So you're just passing by? You're not one of... Them? That... Cult? No, I don't support Trump. Uh -huh. Cult? Mm. Yes, those people I was talking to. Those people took my daughter, Yori. What do you mean, took? So, you're saying your daughter got swept up in the pajama party and hasn't come home since? Yes. I don't know how to turn who to turn to anymore. How old is Iori Chan? She's 20. Just a college student. 20, eh? She's right for the picking then. The girls her age are looking for freedom, and they must have had it on offer. But Iori isn't like that. She's been duped by those people. By that cult! They told her that vaccines are causing people to die. And and they told her that, that uh, to do her own research and watch the Joe Rogan experience and, and Oh, it's horrible. You sure they're a cult? Not just a bunch of kooks in pajamas? That's what they said about the KKK. And look what look, look, look at that. Mm. Yes. I didn't know anything was wrong until I got a call from school saying Iori was missing classes. But she left home every morning, so I followed her one day. And that's when I saw her going into that cult building. When Iori came home, I confronted her about it. Rather than getting upset with my following her, she said, The perfect timing. You should join the order, too. Hmm. I've never seen my daughter so vacant. She gets this faraway look as whenever she talks about this new obsession of hers. I'm sure they've done something to her. She's also been spending her money on these expensive amulets and statues. I told her she needed to get out of this cult. But she ain't exactly listening to reason, is she? Right. The next day, the cultist showed up and took my daughter away. They did 
some resort to force, but they weren't going to leave without her. I know. I gotcha. I've gone to see them many times, pleading to see my Yuri, but they always turn me away at the door. I just recently lost my husband. If I were to lose my poor daughter now. Her daughter's cut up in some weird cult. She can't even see her. That ain't right. That boy ain't right. What's up with everybody, like, losing their, like, significant others or, or, uh, like, mostly dads or moms going missing, like, parents going missing? Like, uh, Goko-chan's mother died, and then, like, uh, Yusuke's dad had his face changed by the Yakuza, and now this woman, her husband died. Good lord. Is there anybody in Japan that has both parents? Oh, no. Um, Hajima-san, was it? May I please make a request? Go for it. I guess I kind of stepped into this one anyway. If it's something reasonable, maybe I can help. Um, would you mind joining that cult for me? You want me to join them? What part of that's reasonable? Well, only disciples are allowed inside. Joining them is the only way to get in. I would stick in myself, but they know my face now. They would never let me pass the doors. I get it. Since they don't know me, I can join them and gain entry with no fuss. Sounds lot. It, it's sound logic, but you must think I'm insane for asking you to do this. We only just met, but I want my daughter back. Majima-san, please, please help me. I will of course provide a reward of some sort. If you could even just tell Iori that I want her to come home, even that would do. Please. Can't say no now. Uh. I not. Huh. Can't very well say no now, can I? But all I can promise is that I'll tell her to come home. Y you will? Oh, thank you. Majima son, please be careful. There's no telling what the order of Munan Chohept Onast is capable of. Onasu. Moonan cho hepito o nasu. Moonan cha cha cha. Oh no! The order of Moonan cho hepito o nasu. You must learn their name. You can't even get that right. These cultists will never trust you. Alright. Uh, a name for a religion, though. Anyway, don't you worry. I got this. I'll sneak my way in, make contact with Yori chan, and sneak my way out. Thank you. Please take this, Majima-san. What is it? Nasta. Received a handmade amulet. What's this? It's just a little charm I made to ward off evil. I think you may need it, Majima-san. For protection. <laughs> <laughs> Hope it really works. Please, please find my daughter, Iori. Okay. Is the entrance to the cult building over here, then? Is that not her daughter? Huh? Those pajama freaks are in the cult that Yori John joined. I gotta help help join them to help her mom. I can't read. Hi. Excuse me. Yes? Do you seek something from us? To meet Yori Chan, I gotta get into this cult. So first, I gotta act like I really wanna join. Uh, it's Onasu. I want to join the order of Munan Choheputo Onasu. No. I want to join the order of Munan Choheputo Onasu. No. Ah, you have come to embrace the divine magnificence of Munan Choheputo Onasu. Do you wish to become yeah. chosen? Absolutely, I do. Munan Choheputo is where it's at. <laughs> Glory be! I can see you will be your most excellent disciple already. Right this way, please. Sure. All right. Where do they come up with this shit anyway? Thank you for committing yourself to our path. May I have your uh, name, please? I'm Majima. Goro Majima. Majima goro -san. Ah, Brother Majima. Onasto were informing me. Now, let's have uh, you... Whoa, hold up a sec. You just threw that psycho babble at me like I was supposed to know what it meant. Oh, 
On last is a word that we use to express a feeling of gratitude and appreciation. Oh, uh, we already have a word for that, but on last to you too. As I was going to say, Brother Mashima, we will have you observe a portion of our activities tonight. You must observe with purpose. It is the first part of your training to absorb our doctrine. There will be a test at the end to measure your faith. This ain't a pop quiz. Gotcha. Well, shall we be... Help! Help me! Help! Oh. Hey, what's all the racket? Apologies, brother. He is a de debaser. Oh, not again. You must be more careful. We have a new recruit with us here. Hi. Yes, I will call for a chast- eh? Ch Chastening? No! Not that, not a chastening, have mercy! Whoa, whoa, hold up. That guy's scared shitless. I don't know what's going on, but maybe you can ease up on him? Your concerns are unfounded, brother Mashima. That poor soul is wrecked by episodic outbursts of manic behavior. Outbursts, eh? This way. No! I wanna go home! There... D d d drugs are happening here. Please, pay it no heed. Let us continue. Hmm. Whoa! What do we got here? This is our prayer room. If we would practice Shure Pipi. Or... Shoot a pee pee. What? Hold up. You slipped that sure up. <laughs> that sure a pee pee thing as if it were the most natural thing in the world. What is it? Sure a pee pee. Ah, but it is. Sure, uh, shoot a pee pee. Or uh, pee pee is training to attain higher enlightenment in the path of Munai Joepti. Okay. Shure Pipi is training. Those engaged in Shure Pipi. Here are, here are our latest recruits. As a collective, we refer to each other as friends. Latest recruits, eh? That lady's lost daughter, yori -chan, could be doing the Shure Pipi thing right here. Shure Pipi gives them focus. Through concentration, they accumulate Kuli... Kuri... Kuri pass. You guys got a dictionary for all this? What's kuripas? Well, to put it in layman's terms, it could be considered a measure of virtue. As we accumulate kuripas, the divine moon and chohepito shall bestow enlightenment and rapture upon us. Uh huh. This is getting so old so fast. Oh, Sister Yorisa, we must sway more. Proper shore pipi is the path of hope. Yes! Onasto for your benevolent guidance. You can just call it Yori? Is that our girl? I'm sorry. I need a minute to help steer our friends towards the path of the, path of the just. Brother Majima, please feel free to observe. I don't like the fact that they're all on their hands and knees going, Sure, pee pee. Here's my chance to see if that friend is our girl, Yori chan. Where is this guy? Is he in the, the back here? Where'd he go? This is, uh... This is a little weird. I, uh... Oh, I thought this was supposed to be a mirror. That's a stage. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I'm, I'm trying not to, like, put it in these people's face faces, but... That looks like you're looking down at him and he's gonna look up. Hold on. Aw. Oh, I, was, I was trying to get it to, like, zoom in on Majima's pee-pee and then, like, have people in the background chanting Shota pee-pee, but, like, it, it wasn't working. Alright, what's up, Yori? No. Hey, sister. Ain't that Mr. Mister on the radio? Stereo? That thing you do ain't fair, you know. Sister, that guy called it Yuri, right? 
ignoring me, huh? She wants to concentrate on her shoot at pee pee thing. But I gotta see if this girl's really Yori John. What'll I say to her? Crack a dumb pun. Call her Iori. Or claim to be Munan Chohep. I'm gonna crack a dumb pun, dude. That's my MO. People can't help laughing when it's most inappropriate. I'll give her a certain body side splitter to open her up. That sounds suggestive. Wanna avoid dangerous cults? Just practice safe sex! Ah! That did not work. Ah, oh, come on! Even I'm dying at that one! I'm blinking back at the tears here! Or blinking back to tears here. Claim to be the d the dude! Let's go. Maybe if I name drop their god, she'll be open to listening. Worth a try. Munan Cho Hepto. My what? I come bearing great times. What blasphemy? How dare you take the blessed name of our master, the great Munan Cho Hepto. Whoa, she got totally steeped. Still. Finally got your attention. You're Yori chan, ain't ya? What? How do you know my name? Bam! This girl is that lady's missing daughter. Yori chan, listen up. I got a message from your mom. My mom? Yeah. She asked me to get in here and tell you to come home. Mo Mother. 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 Mother, mother, mother! Yeah, I agree! Great series! I've never played a mother game. But I've I've heard great things. Earthbound? Earthbound beginnings? Earthbound Zero? I don't know what the actual official one is. Uh Mother 3 that's never been released over here. Yeah. Well, you said a fourth there's not a fourth one, sorry. They canceled that one on the N64. What the Yori chan? Ah! Mother! My head! It hurts! Ah! Hey, what's wrong? Snap at it! Brother Majima! What is going on here? You must not disturb our disciples and shoot at Pipi! Oh, yeah, sorry, my bad. She got distracted by my shoot at Pipi. Sister Yori san, are you well? Mm. Yes, I think so. Brother Majima, please be careful when speaking to fellow disciples. Our friends are purging memories of family and their worldly ties to attain a spiritual pre- Say what? Purging memories? Uh, this is- this is- this is how Junko did it. This is- this is the start of Danganronpa. This is- they're, they're the remnants of despair. Yes, as a rule, our disciples undergo a mental cleansing process so they may better dedicate themselves to Shurepi. But that's... <clears throat> My friends! I ask for your attention! What's up? Today, our guru has come to inspire us in our climb toward ever higher states of enlightenment through Shure Pipi. Oh. Friends, our spiritual leader, Guru Munan Suzuki! For free, dude? My disciples. Munanjo. Alright, look, look. Hold on. This, this way. This way. Dude, no, do it again. I didn't. I didn't what, what did you do? Do it again. What's it like? Munanjo, muchacho. Oh yeah, that, that was it. Munancho. You too, Brother Majima. Wait, the hell is a moon moon nacho? Munancho is our word for greeting. Incidentally, our word for farewell is hepto. Brother Majima, please. Say it with the pose, dude. Munancho. I shake your shake your shake. Nicely done. Two spirit points awarded. Huh? 
Okay. SP is better than whatever the heck I'm getting in the actual game, so. Glory be. A most splendid greeting. Our savior and master, Moonan Chohepto, is most pleased. This guy looks familiar, but I can't quite put my finger on it. No idea it was physically possible to be this phony. This is actually kind of impressive. So, friends, tell me, how much titherance have you all contributed to the exalted Moonan Trample? I have con contributed five Rincho! I have done better at eight Rincho. What the fuck is a Rincho? Titherance is what we call a ties. Uh, okay, I was just about to ask that. So how much is a rincho worth? One rincho is a hundred thousand. A hundred thousand? Iman! Or Ichiman! Ichiman enda! These disciples are kicking up that much order? Hey. It's all a process to greater enlightenment and joy. When one is bound by chains of gold, there can be no freedom. Renouncing our possessions is the first step to the rapture. No matter how phony it is, I thought I'd be okay if it made people feel better. But damn, they're just straight up stealing from these suckers. Ah, so much difference. Glory be. Onasto, my friends. Oh, sister. Iori-san, was it? You appear somewhat pale. Are you feeling well? Hi. Y yes, I'm fine. Onasto, for your kind concern, Kuro. Yes! Why do you, why do you like, yell that one? <laughs> Incidentally, Yori-san, how much Titherance have you tendered toward your I... I haven't been able to put together enough money yet. What? A false friend? Such a shameful lack of faith. I beg for your forgiveness. Shame! But friends, do not chastise our sister yori -san. We all have worldly excuses. Guru Monan Suzuki. You must understand. Titherance is an especially valued form of Shure Bitti. If you are alone and lacking Rinjo, Sister Yorisan, your Guri Pass will be stunted. Oh no! What can I do? Oh, Titherance is a donation. Shure Bitti is some kind of meditation, and Guri Pass is what now? God damn it, I can barely keep this gibberish straight. Sister Oyori-san, I am happy to observe that you are blessed with divine physicality and transcendent beauty. Engaging in- oh. No! Special shoot at Pipi! Guru is an honor. The most sacred form of shoot. It bestows enormous goodie pass. It sure does. Right on her face. What? I blacked out. We shall experience it together shortly. Go and cleanse your body and feelings. Rapture. I shall go. Epudon, friends. Please continue with your short happy. Onasto. I don't like this! Where's the Orichan gone to? I know not the details, but it is among the most sacred of Shuri. The disciple Christ is one, body and soul. Become as one, eh? It is a special Shuri Pipi allowed only to women, and even among men, only to the chosen. If I were not a man, I wish I could partake in its grand glory. That This is. Mm. Yeah! How do these pajama twits not get wise to this scam? Her mom only wanted me to get a message to Yori-chan, so I'm technically done with what I promised to do. But now Yori-chan's in real danger, so screw it. I'm extending my measurement. Measurement? No, 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 no. Membership. Whew. Your tour is over, Brother Mashima. It is time for your test. My test? What's your damn horses? I ain't got time right now. Are you sure? By demonstrating you have learned the ways of the order, you may earn a blessing in person. Say what? You mean I can meet the old guru if I do good on your test? You're on then. Very well. It will be a simple oral exam. Yes, 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 so will hers. 
the quiz really determined how attentive you were during your tour. For sure! The first question. In the order of Munan Johepto Nast. What do we say to express our gratitude? Nast. Nast. Splendid! Correct, brother. Your third part to Piece of cake. I'll have to do better than that. Your second question. What do we call the training we undergo to accumulate kulipa? Shura pipi. Shura poopu. Ita poopu. Shura pipi. Wonderful. Great. You have practiced proper shura pipi during your brief tour. Very impressive. For sure. I'm the shura pipi king. The third question. Munancho is a greeting in the order of Munancho. Please demonstrate it. Oh. Uh, do the hustle. Uh, it was like the left hand and then like that. So, yeah. Munancho. There you go. All right. Normally, I'd screw around with these answers, but like this, this lady might be in major trouble. Excellent. Truly, a textbook example of Munancho. I got the moves. Very well. The final question. Do you remember the name of our guru? Uh, Munan Suzuki. These are all very common Japanese names. Munan Suzuki, right? Heir to the Suzuki. Automobile fortune. Bravo, correct. Perhaps it was too easy a question. You think? He's, uh, larger than life. With that, we are done. Your test is at an end. Splendidly done. You scored a perfect four out of four. It speaks to your attentiveness during your tour. Someone of your caliber may even qualify as a leadership candidate. <laughs> Munan Majima's got a nice ring to it. Brother Majima, I can find no fault with you. You are worthy of receiving our guru's benediction in person. Follow me. I will show you to our guru's course. Hope you chan still okay. Guru Munan Suzuki, please excuse us. I like the dolphins. And the, the butterfly with the... That doesn't make sense. Ah, oh, is that our new friend, Kennedy? What was it now? It's Brother Majima. Pleased to meet you. <laughs> Brother Majima's a rare find. An extraordinary individual. Good. He is most worthy of your divine benediction. I see. That is music to my ears. If matters I must attend to, so let's not waste any time. There. You have my blessing. Uh, yeah, that's just Munancho. That's all that- uh, That's it? You got some crystal. You call this stuff your blessing? Is there a problem? No, I suppose not. Guru. Guru, excuse me. Oh, no. There she is. Ah. You have ready yourself for shoot it. Hi. Yes. Cleanse myself thoroughly. I. Mm. Mm. They knew. They do exactly what they were doing with that line. They a hundred percent. A hundred percent. They knew what they were doing with that line. Fucking yikes. Excellent. Since I already performed your benediction, both of you should leave it at once. Hey, Alright, end of the road. But don't stop this now. This shoot at pee pee piss on's gonna have his way with Yori chan. Shoot at pee pee with me instead so I can kick your butt or cut it off or something. Yori chan, forget this granola guru. How about you just shoot at pee pee with me instead? Oh, I thought it was I thought we were gonna be talking to him. I beg your pardon? Would Shura Pee be with you add to my Kuripas? Uh, it might not do anything for you, Kuripas, but... Then there is no need. Brother Majima, what is the meaning of this outburst? Exit my chamber at once! Uh, what was I thinking? That made me sound just like this Guru Guru. I am Munanju. 
I am Munan Chohe. Chohe. Hear me, Oita. Flee! Flee at once for your home. How dare you! You must never take Munan Choheputo's name in jest. Brother Majima, that is utter blasphemy. You spit in the face of our divinity. Who put you up to this? Please forgive me, Majima-san. You will be doomed to eternal damnation. <sighs> Invoking the big man's name sure gets people riled up around here. What's my plan? Yeah, your mom's gonna be heartbroken, dude. What the, the normal answer. Iori-chan, you're being conned. Your mom's gonna be heartbroken. Mom? Mm. Who is mom? My head. It hurts. You can't... F Dude, he just glitched out a little bit there. What? You can't forget your mom, Yori chan They might have messed with your memory, but you gotta remember the woman who raised you. Stop it, Maji, my son. Awakening the memories of friends is a sin beyond all sins. Shut your face, you damn phony. Yori chan snap out of it. I'll take you home to your mom. Uh, what is... Mom? Ah! Oh, this, it's my mother's amulet. Huh? Yori-chan, do you remember now? Ugh, I, I don't know, but why did I ever think I wanted to become one with the shady old hippie? You're thinking straight now, at least. <sighs> this woman was ripened. Mine for the plane. How dare you interfere? I, yeah, I'm going to interfere. I'm going to beat the shit out of you. Guru Monan Suzuki? See? There's your snake oil shilling fraud showing his true colors. Guru Pajama Pants has been milking all of you. Silence! Alright, let's go, dude. Men it just says menacing man. Alright. Oh my word! Hold on, do I have any, uh... Do I have any, like... Good weapons? Yeah, give me the stun gun. Good thing I have all that takoyaki. Okay. There we go. There we go! Had to focus up a little bit there, but I got him. There we go! Right in the face, dude! Listen, bitch. Ow, right in the back. All right, get up. Get out of here. Into the cabinet. Get out. Sorry, I had to focus up there a little bit. Do I have? Guru, we are terrible noises. Is everything all right? Friends, quickly, you must call me an ambulance. Our guru is gravely injured. You must perform the ritual of healing for him. Everyone! Munan! Uh, no, you dipshits. Waving your hands around me won't fix anything. Should it be? 
kick you right in the shoot at beep beep. I was like that too, wasn't I? Yori-chan, we should get you home. Right. Can I like save all the rest of those people from that idiot? Alright, I feel good about doing that sub story. That was good. Yori? Mom! Are you done with that crazy religion? Yes. I'm over it. Mom, I... I wanted to bring Dad back. Huh? What? Ever since Dad died, you haven't stopped crying. There was nothing I could do for you. That's when they told me the dead could be brought back to life. I just had to do these rituals and earn a few spirit points. I should have known how insane it was. I guess I just got caught up in that cult scam. So that's why. But I know now that if I followed those terrible people, I'd be leaving you all alone. That's even worse. I'm so sorry. No, I should be the one saying sorry. I didn't know how much anguish I was causing. I'm so sorry. Thank you, Ajima-san. I only asked you to deliver a message, but you got my daughter back. I can never thank you enough. <laughs> no problem at all. I'd say I got a pretty spiritual experience out of it, too. Ajima-san, please take this as our thanks. Seems hardly of any value for all you did for us, though. What is it? A traveler's amulet? Oh, is it the, the thing that she dropped? Yeah. Oh, right. Yori chan. I gotta give this to you. This to you. You handed over the hand. Oh, the handmade one. Okay. It's, it's mom's. The amulet totally worked, you know. After all, you got some free pajamas out of it, Yori chan. You hold on to that amulet and let it protect you. You and your mama. Keep the family together, will you? I will. Marjima son. What's up? Thank you. You saved us. It's all good. All right. Glad I got to kick that guy in his shoot at beep beep. Oh wait, is the the the, the, the you kid back with the thing, or is that the the bathroom one? There's a lot of sub stories in this like one tiny park. What's up, guys? This is the toilet where I wrote back to the lonely lady on the wall. Should I check it out? Absolutely! What could possibly go wrong? I offered to chat with the lonely lady who's been writing graffiti on the toilet wall. Hey, there's some new writing under my reply, and it's the same handwriting. What do you like? She wrote back. Guess you can't ignore the networking potential of public toilets. So, what do I write in the reply? Oh, uh, I wear a suit at work. No, that's the guy that was in the Odyssey that I wanted to see, but I couldn't find the Odyssey. Who's Mike? <laughs> Hold on, there's just a there's just a fucking little like sign next to that window there that just says Mike. With a really bad drawing of a dude. Does it say anything else? Uh, that, I, it's not close enough for me to, It just says Mike. There's Japanese above it, but it's not close enough for me to be able to read it. Okay, I'm, I wear a suit at work. So I just got distracted. <laughs> just telling it like it is. I don't know to do. You sound boring. I'll drop by to see if she says anything back to me later. Uh, hey Majima, I'm pretty sure that's the, just the guy's room. Pretty sure it's a dude. But you know, you're the gay pirate, so we'll see where this leads. Oh, I, I don't have the, the skill to beat that guy up right now. How much money do I have? 11 mil? Let's buy some ability, shall we? I need 15 for that one. I think I need 15 for that too. I need 15 for the rising kick. Okay, what else can I get with slugger? Uh, oh, another health boost for two. Sure. Uh, oh, and uh, another health boost. For another two. Sure, any, any other health boosts that I can get here? Nope, that's all. Yeah. These are all 15 mil. And that one I need mastery, which means I need to talk to the... the... people who taught me that style. 
for those. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah, I can't get another power surge thing. So, seven mil, huh? But I don't feel like facing Mr. Shakedown right now. I'm gonna get out of here. I'm gonna, what's this? Taco Bell? Oh no, this is the karaoke bar. Okay, oh, uh, I'm just gonna get, 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 get out, get out, get out. Okay, where was that convenience store? It was like over here, right? That the guy was going, it wasn't Don Quixote. It was a different one. Also that, is that little girl still standing in front of that shop? Wherever that was? Or is she gone? Was that over here? Was that over, oh that was way over here. I think. The convenience store is over here, so let's go there. Uh, right? The little girl standing in front of the shop is way over there, I think. Uh, well, I don't have a sub-story icon over there, so like, that won't do anything. I do have one in the bathroom again. So, I guess we'll keep going with the sub-stories. Hey man, did you hurt your feet? Hmm? That boy on his ass. What the fellow was in a hurry to buy some lip balm? What's up, dude? Ow. Hey, you down again? Oh, hi again. It's my feet. The pain's spreading and worsening. Man, didn't I tell you to slow it down and walk? Yes, you did. But I was in a hurry, I'm sorry. Jeez, how chapped were your lips? Ouch, ow, ow, my feet. Hey, you gonna make it? Ugh. I only had some medicine with me. Medicine, huh? I don't have any. I don't have any, sorry. I I should go to the drugstore. Is that there, there's a drugstore around here, right? That's the temple. That's the pawn shop. That's the import shop. There was a drugstore in Camarocho. I don't know if there's a drugstore here. There's the drugstore. All right. Hold on. I got to go buy this man some drugs. Guy's got Advil. Oh, damn. I gotta... Hello, boys. Get out. Ow. Oh, I missed. Ow. Get out of here. Oh, my heat's down. There we go. Up against the wall, Shibuya. I don't care if the, you're named after the, or the city's named after you. You're going down. Where's the other guy? I beat him down with a cone. Oh, I can throw it at him. Hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> yeah, stop your attack with a cone. Get out of here. All right. Ah! How are you here? You were just in the park. Hi, boys. I just want to go to the drugstore. Get out. Ow. All right. Hold on, I wanna do a cartwheel in your face. There we go. I didn't get much money for that because I sucked. But. All right. How do I sprint? Like, actually, how do I sprint? That's how I think. I'm holding the A. Yeah, that's how I sprint. Okay. You hold A to sprint. Good to know. Do I have, like, a sprint meter or something? That also really doesn't feel... Oh, my... 
Could you stop attacking me? Okay, I, I want to... Come on! Oh, is that guy down? Okay. He must be. Get out of here, Yoko! Okay. Beat the crap out of that guy. I I just want to go across the bridge to the drugstore. Wait, who, who said Earth? Was it those guys? No, it's this guy. Ugh. Ah, uh, what the? What's with this Boy. creeper? Hey, you! This is no nap. This is a no napping zone. Why don't you get up and move along? Ugh, I'm hurt. Did this guy gets the snot kicked out of him. He's in so much pain he can't even talk. I okay. I gotta go buy two people medicine. All right, got. Okay, people. I need. To go over and buy medicine. What's with the person? Hello? Is a is the person a, a shopper? Or? or what's Oh, oh, that's that's the okay, that's the Chinese restaurant. Yeah, there's the girl. Check it out a little Oh come on! She ain't old enough to Keep your eyes, people, would you? No, fool. Ah, uh, no! Yeah! I'm gonna beat the crap out of these guys. Here we go. Got something real nice for you, little girl. Come over. Don't wanna. Huh? Oh, fucking brat. You're coming one way or the other. Ah, no. Leave me alone. See? What did I tell ya? Who the hell are you, old man? Nobody special. Just looking out for a stranger. Huh? Stranger? Then mind your own business. Don't go getting any ideas. We'll make sure you look out. Next time you ought to take my advice and head straight home, kiddo. This is a dangerous town, full of scumbags. Huh? Scumbags? Nobody calls me scum. Not after these, not with these cheekbones. Menacing, me no, no, these are kidnappers. Kidnappers. Yeah, get out of here. Oh, he gave me the bat. Get out. Little punch sound effect. God, look, we're sorry. Give me a break. Good for nothing, losers. Thanks, sir. Sir, I'm only 24, you know, and I'm only 26. I'm older than Marsh. Anyway, as I was saying, why don't you head on home? Okay. Something wrong? You and your mom fight? Uh, no. What's up? The doll. Huh? The red chestnut, the squirrel. Chestnut, the squirrel. You mean that red squirrel prize in the UFO checker? Or catcher? Uh, yeah. You want uh, that? Yeah. I'm sure your dad will buy you one if you ask nice. Dad, okay, sorry. Oh, sorry, Skip. Like I said, does anybody in Japan in 1988 have parents? Both of them at the same time. Uh. It's okay, I'm fine. Still, no point hanging around here. You can't get it yourself, can you? It's okay. I don't need it. But it's so cute, I just like to look at it. Yeah? You're a strange kid. All right. 
I gotta get going. Okay. Friendship with the doll girl. You got to know the doll girl. Interacting with her will gradually fill the friendship gauge. You can, I know how friendship works, okay? A red chestnut the squirrel doll, huh? Can't ever stand out here all day, so if I grab one, maybe I'll give it to her. Yes, yeah, okay, let's go get the doll then. Hi. Have a good time. Oh, right. You're, you're, I'm going to be able to watch you in the, okay. Yeah. All right. Let me go get the red squirrel thing. Where is it? Oh, the, okay. With the red hat. Got it. Okay. Uh, insert a coin. All right. Here we go. Give me knockoff sandy cheeks. Oh, got her right in the neck. Oh, 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 oh. Two for the price of one, Grandma. Give me the belt. <laughs> hey. Hey, what do you think I should uh, send back to? Uh, what do I, What do you think I should send back to storage? The diamond plate or one of my ninety thousand pieces of takoyaki? I think I can spare some room with some takoyaki. Okay. Cool. Let's go, dude. Let's go. All right, I have the doll I can give you. What? You still staring at that chestnut the squirrel doll? Huh? Oh, yeah, I am. I have one of those red chestnut the squirrel dolls now. We ought to give it to her. Yeah, give it to her. I don't need the doll. Ah, fine, here. Get it over the chestnut the squirrel. Wow, it's a red chestnut the squirrel. It's adorable. Yeah? Well, it ain't exactly my thing, so why don't you keep it? Really? Thanks, sir. I never got a present from anyone besides my mom before. Best day ever. That's so. Well, glad you like it. Now, will you get on home? Yeah! I'm gonna tell my mom all about it. Thanks, sir. Bye! See you later. Boy, that's a little scam's a handful. But it feels kind of nice to make her day like that. Majima's a good person. All right. Guys, come on. I'm just trying to buy some medicine for this guy. What are you... You guys are like the worst bodyguards in existence. Oh, right in the chest, dude. All right, give me, give me the sign. Bam! Well, he's down for the count. Get. Oh, oh, oh. The Kubo maneuver. Oh, I wanted to hit him into the pole. I wanted to see if there was like a special thing for Hangman in the pole. Okay. Well, hold on, let me let me save real quick. Okay. I have not made any story progress whatsoever. I just need to get to the drugstore. I just need to buy this man some drugs. Actually, both men some drugs. Oh, I passed the drugstore. Oops. Wait. Oh yeah, the, the drugstore is the one with the with the the cute uh, mascot. Hello. Yes, I would like one drug, please. Actually, two drug. 
Daikoku Drugstore. Where's the counter? Hey. Uh, legendary drinker of Ryuku. Uh, tasty as it is healthy. Heart can, uh, pleasure can give you pleasure. Health and heat, tour and air heat, toughness. Appstim RX. Stimulates the appetite by improving digestive tract function. Okay. But, like... It, do you have, like, Advil? Super effective against hangovers. This drink brings out the diehard in you. Uh, super turmeric. Uh, extreme lemon. Well, if I can just buy these things. What, what do I have? I, I think I have a Stamina and Royale. Yeah, sure. I'll buy one of those. All right, I'll give both of them stamina on Royale. See if that helps them. I, w I was looking for, like, pills. But, like, I hope this works. All right. Hopefully, Shakes isn't over here. Hopefully, Shakes has left the building. All right. Oh, Shakes is, Shakes is over there. I saw him. Hopefully, he's leaving. Hi. What's up? Get out of here. Oh, he's down. Get out. Into the river with you. Where's the last guy? Oh, there he is. Once again? Get out of here. I was going to say into the river with you, but the, the, you didn't go in the river. You just went. A point right. All right. Hopefully, Shake's turned uh, left. I don't see him anymore. Here, have a stamina and royale. Yeah. Here, drink this. It'll help. Pardon? You mean I can have this? Yeah, it's all yours. Thank you so much. Whew, the pain's fading away. Thank you again. Good to hear. By the way, did you get those chap lips of yours taken care of? Pardon? My chap lips? I'm sorry, I don't understand. What's not to understand? You were the one hauling ass to get a lip balm. Were your lips about to fall off or what? Oh, I see the misunderstanding now. It wasn't for me. I was rushing because the girl I like asked me to get it for her in a hurry. Oh, gotcha. You were doing your girl a favor earlier? Yeah, basically. I run errands <laughs> like that for her all the time. <laughs> really? And you don't mind being a little errand boy? Go get me this, run out and get that. Not at all. She really trusts me, so I'm happy to go out and get things for her. She's using you. Errands are opportunities for me to get her to notice me. Yeah, that's the thing. Like, notice you. She should already be doing that. Uh-huh. Can't shake the feeling that this girl is just using him, but if that floats his boat, I ain't gonna rock it. And because I was so diligent about running errands, she's given me a nickname. When we first met, she just called me by my last name. I'm making headway. That's so. What'd she call you now? She calls me Eranku. <sighs> that ain't a nickname to be proud of. I've just got a sharp sense of humor, and it cuts too deep. Listen, that nickname of yours. You do realize she's turned you when you were into a personal servant, don't you? Huh? Is that really how it looks? But even if that were true, I still have a crush on her. That's all well and good, but she's running your feet into the ground. Literally. The medicine's a nice quick fix for now, but I doubt you're all healed up. Maybe you're right. I'll try talking to her and see if she gives me permission to stop running errands for her. He's not a quitter, I'll give him that. But if she wants anything, I've got to be the one who goes out and get it for her. It has to be. Well, I should be going. Thank you so much again. Okay, bye. 
head on Goku. I can understand wanting to impress the girl of your dreams, but don't let it turn into a nightmare. Yeah. I, I was I was running behind you, sir. I wasn't even running into you. All right. Now. Oh, Don Quixote was right there. Okay. Wait, he's back over there again? Hi. Hi, miss. Hi, Bob. Uh, now to the guy over here that also needed help. Right, I can sprint. Forgot about that. Hey, man. Oh, sorry. Hey, man. Do you need this other stamina royale that I got? Have this. Here you go, pal. Drink this. Uh, huh? I don't think that helped him. Oh, no, it did. It just showed the drunk guy over there. But it's not where he is. You alright? Yeah, I'm feeling much better now. Thank you. Wanna tell me what happened? Why'd you get laid out? It's because I was chasing a dream. Here we go. What's this about a dream? It's my dream to boldly walk across a wild bridge. Oh, right. A grand old dream like walking across this bridge. Sure does explain why you got beat to an inch of your life. Except not really. Huh? I mean, come on. It wouldn't take more than a minute or two to just stroll right across this bridge. But it's not that simple. And why is that? It's because of this stajun I'm wearing. Sutajun? I don't... I don't know what that is. Is that what? Oh, no! You don't know what a... Yeah, no, not that. You know, at the time, it's so not cool. Stajun is short for stadium jump. It's a jacket worn by athletes at stadiums, so they stay warm and limber. Overseas, they call these varsity jackets. But here in Japan, it's stajun all the way. Neat. But why in the world would wearing a stajun make you make it so you couldn't cross Iwao Bridge? Well, you put on a jacket like this and you pop the collar, and suddenly everything's everyone thinks you're some kind of big shot. All the pumps come punks come charging out looking for blood. But the jacket didn't say bring on the fights. <sighs> Tried crossing eight times now, but every time goon show up and beat the crap out of me before I can make it. That's certainly a uh, unique problem. But there's gotta be other dudes wearing jackets like that, right? They aren't all getting mauled by the riffraff. Right? I can't explain it, but when I do it, I get so much heat. Does my face piss people off? Or is it just my destiny? Destiny is an asshole if that's the case. But alright, at least I get why you were bleeding out on the pavement here. Yeah. So here's a novel idea. Maybe take off the stasher? It seems to me that's the source of all your woes. But that defeats the purpose. I love this stajun. You wouldn't believe how much trouble I went through to get this sweet jacket. I want to wear it loud and proud. That's, that's my dream. Well, it's a free country, but I wager you got another beat and come down the pipe and go through with it. That's what complicates things. Oh, I'm sorry. How rude of me. My name is Su- uh, My name is Suda. Suda-chan, huh? I'm Majima. Majima, son. If you don't mind me saying, you look like a man who can wade into brawls and walk away without a hair out of place. Ah! Shoot at peep now! Now we understand. Shoot at peepee! Well, I've got a hair tie, but yeah, I can hold my own. Majima, son. I'm sorry if this sounds wimpy, but do you think it'd help me make my dream come true? Huh? What do you mean? Yeah, I saw this coming. I know it's probably an imposition, but do you think you could fend off the goons while I strut proudly across Iwao Bridge? You're not kidding about being an imposition. I'm sorry. But without the help of a guy like you, my dream will forever be unfilled. I have a lifetime of regret. Please, Majima-san. Please help me realize my dream. Yeah, whatever, dude. I've been beating the crap out of people the whole game. Oh, all right, fine. I'll help you. You'll really do this? You mean it? I mean, I know I asked, but I didn't expect to meet a person kind enough to get into a fist fight for me. Yeah, story of my life. But well, you're serious about this stajun, 
drawing out goons like flies on rotten fruit. Oh, yes, totally. Just watch. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It's a goon. Huh? Hey, you. You think you're hot shit in that jacket? Huh? You trying to start something? Huh? See? <sighs> yeah, I'm seeing it. Can't tell if it's that style shooter or you that's drawing all this aggro. Okay. I'm gonna strut proudly down this bridge. Please keep me safe. Enjoy your stroll, brud. Brud? <laughs> Enjoy your stroll, bruv. These punks are gonna pay the toll to the troll. Protect the civilian! Okay. Oh. Hey, hey, you get out of here. Ida Gucci? Thought you'd get away, huh? Oh, you bitch. You ready? Okay, there's a lot of... That's a lot of people. Hey, 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 hey! Hey, 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 hey! Oh my goodness, there's so many people. Holy crap! Hey, hey, get away from him! Hey, bruvs! Oi, bruvs! Hey, hey, hey! He made it! Okay. He almost died, but he made it. Yes! I finally did it! I made it all the way across Iwao Bridge while wearing my beloved Stajun! <laughs> Good Hi. for you. Yes! Thank you, Majima-san! You made my dream come true. I'd like you to have this, if the best I can do is my thanks. An encounter finder? I don't think I've ever been this happy. I'll never forget what you did for me today. <laughs> Cruising around in the jacket is that big a deal to you? Or not, dude. I know. I don't think most people understand how much this meant to me. But still, it was my dream. Guess that's true of most dreams. Sorry, I shouldn't have called you odd. No need to apologize, Majima-san. I owe you a life debt. You never need to apologize to me, ever. <laughs> I take it back. You're an odd dude, Suda-chan. <laughs> I guess so. I get told that often. Well, after that most satisfying accomplishment, I'm hungry. I'm gonna head for home and food. <laughs> See ya. Good luck on those bridges. Yes. Thank you and goodbye. I didn't really solve his issue. He's gonna get- Oh, you have to go back across the bridge to go home? I guess it ain't so much about what others think of you. If it's something you want to do, you better get to it. Super John was pretty weird, but his philosophy is right up. That's a real man. Teach the real man to- Yeah, he got- He's getting the shit beat out of him again. Hey, what's with the hard-ass Stajun? You trying to be funny? Bring on the fights, huh? Let's get it on, then. Help! <sighs> Take it off and go home, man. Alright, what's up, mighty? How are you? You are wonderful. I hope you're doing well as well. I'm doing pretty good. Uh, I have just been getting, like, sub-story after sub-story after sub-story here. Okay. Uh, wait. With zoom in. Oh, right. Trigger zoom in. Okay. Do I have any other... Okay, so he's over there. These two sub-stories are here. I'll continue these later. I, I'm gonna go to Majima's apartment and, like, see what's actually up here. I'm, I'm gonna advance the story just a tad. Just, just a smidgy bit. Just like the babyest bit. I need to get back here, please. My apartment's back here. Wait, is my apartment on the other side? Of, my apartment's on the other side of it. Yeah. I th I'm on the wrong side of the bridge. I thought I was on the other side. Hold on. Oh, I... I She's here again, okay. It's that girl from the other day. Alright, 
Well, now I have sub story here too. Hold on. I would like to advance the main story. Give me a second. Huh? I just keep walking into these sub stories, dude. What the hell is that? I don't recall there being a statue there. All right, I'll deal with that in a little bit. I just keep walking into these sub stories. We need a little bit of main story or we'll never finish this game. My word. Bros. Bros. I'm just trying to go home. Get out of here. He was not standing up when I did that. Get out of here. What's up, man? Ow. A lot of untouchable thanks to you, but you can get out of here. Okay. I didn't use a thing. All the sub-stories are auxiliary organs to the main story. They'll eventually combine to make the main story as such. I don't doubt that you're right. But. It's all I've done for the past, like, three hours. And I feel like I need to, like, advance the story at least a, 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 the teensiest bit. Please doubt that I'm right. I made that up. Oh, okay. Huh? Oh. Do I know you? Yeah, I'm with Odyssey. Greedy bells. Odyssey? Odyssey? Look, if this is about Nozomi, Yamagata and I worked out a deal. Odyssey, you say? It's right there! Oh, hold on, some important stuff is happening. She's a manager, okay? I mean, don't, you got bosses like boulders to come and poach our number one girl. I heard about your little customers, King Boss. They say you'll never even get down on your knees and beg. Or you'll even get down on your knees and beg. Some Lord of the Night. Sounds freaking bad. You that hard up for cash? Well, look at our boots ain't gonna get this one. You're welcome to shine him though. <laughs> You fellas got me right. Yeah. My customer is my king. <laughs> but you're not my customers. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. There you go. <laughs> This mug talk's gonna sound funny because I have a busted mouth. Do it. Whoa, 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 whoa. Soten body goons. What's up, boys? Get out of here, man. Well, that's the main guy now. Anybody else? You wanna have a go? Yeah, come and have a go! If you think you're hard enough. Oh, hey. Ow. Hey, man. My heat! Oh, wait, no, hold on. I got- I got a thing. Let me- let me just drink the- the heat stuff. Give me some heat, and then I'll show ya. Into the wall, Takano! Alright, man. Into the wall with you! Komatsu! Yeah, get down! Easy. 
Peter. This guy's some kind of monster. No, no, no. What are you? You want revenge? Come stand at my club. As long as you're my customer, I'll get down on my knees and grog as much as you want. Do your worst. Uh, I, I, I forgot, like, normally I'm letting, if, if it's voice acted, I'm letting it be voice acted in Japanese. Mostly because I'm learning it, but, like, I'm a little bit conflicted on that point only because, uh, like, I don't know, this is a stream, it's supposed to be entertaining. But, like, I like being able to hear the Japanese as it's voice acted and, like, read it. But, like, that doesn't mean that it, it provides entertainment for the stream. So, like, I'm, I'm torn on that. This is your pad, Majima. Just go inside. If it's like a cutscene, cutscene, I'll uh, I'll let the voice acting take care of it. But. That's not good for you, Majima. Hello? Who are you? Dade is guy. Wait, Dade is witch, isn't it? I look at my notes again. I'm assuming those are all the... The Yakuza things. No. Is Do Dore. I think is, uh, which and Dare is who. Right? I have these things written down somewhere. Oh, I don't know if I'm going to be in the Oh, that's the end of the chapter? There wasn't... There wasn't a chapter boss, though? Okay, so I guess I'll get back to those sub-stories at, like, a later time? Okay. Earn through battle. Lots. Earn through minigames. Not a lot. Okay. Climax battles item opened. There wasn't a boss! It was just four easy dudes! Yeah, sure. Chapter... Yon. Proof of Resolve. I use Premiere. Three years ago in Kamurocho. That's not Majima. Oh, Yodai. Oh. That's Majima. まがいもんは一切なし。同時マグミ経由で仕入れた昇進証明の本門屋。
出所直後の上野義治を都内のラーメン屋で襲うそういう計画ですよね実はあの計画ちょっと問題がありましてね予定を変更させてもらうことになりましたこのまま襲撃に向かえば道島組長いや島野さんにも迷惑をかけることになってしまいます兄弟はもう向かってねえやじゃあ俺はどうしたらいいんじゃま真島さんあんたは俺に兄弟を裏切れっちゅうんかこのまま見殺しにせえっちゅうんか落ち着いて落ち着いて俺は行くたとえどんな裏があってもかまへん俺にとって西島はたった一人の兄弟なんじゃ真島さんでもそれじゃああなたの身もうるさい関係ないわこっちは備えのもんとっくに捨てる払ってきたんじゃそうですかそれじゃ仕方ありませんね Did you shoot me in the eye? Wait, do I get to play in the past? Oh, no, I don't. Oh, they're gonna cut my eye out here. Okay. Okay. Mm. Ooh, ow. Mm. Anybody, else's, anybody else's eye just like randomly hurts? He did have, he, he, he does have a dweeby haircut right now. Is it just me? Or, or does Shimano kind of look like, uh, Oh, what's his, what's his name? The bald guy from Spider Man. Kingpin. Shimano looks like Kingpin. Well, that explains where the eye went. <sighs> Didn't he just learn he died? Uh, judging by that, I'm going to say no. Majima, baby, you need a mattress. He clearly doesn't really care for himself. Another shit night's sleep. Gotta get to work. Not much else I can do right now. Alright, well, we learned some backstory. And it's morning now. Let's go see if that lady wrote on the bathroom wall. Lady. Hold on. Okay. Wanna know what that said. Alright. To work? But wait! I have... I'm gonna go this way. Oh, sorry. Sorry, people. Sorry. I have sub-stories! Also, I have to pee again because I've been downing my water like a madman. So, uh, B 
Before we go to the bathroom, I'm gonna go to the bathroom. I'll be right back once again. Enjoy the clips. Probably hit you with that, right? No. How'd I- What? I just ran into him before and the beetle got hurt. Why did he get hurt that- Why? Please. Are you gonna- Are you gonna let me buy? No, you're not. Let's go see if I can find some seeds. Not that I think that there would be seeds in these things. But. Hey, there were seeds in those things. All right. There we go. No, he's not stunned for long enough. Just kidding. Get out of here. That was stupid. Now that I've done that, Cosmic, I read that it in the chat about halfway through that. I didn't do it on purpose. Stop backseating. Let me figure things out. For oh, I could just I could have just jumped straight down here. I don't know what that guy's there for. Probably just his coins, honestly. In the soup. Oh, we need my entire ass. Yeah. All right, send him out that way. Is it gonna work? No, it just really hurts him. No, it just really, he's just, he's in immense pain. Oh no. I, I thought it was going to be like, fire him off. I didn't know it was going to be like, <laughs> right in his face. That poor man. I'm so... Hey, you're going to go on the front of my, of my thing, right there. And then I'm going to hit this and hopefully it sets on fire. There's, this doesn't propel. I thought I made a rocket booster. Are you kidding me? This does nothing? It's... Let's go. Oh, I didn't even... He was, I didn't actually know he was going to say that. Okay. Dude, tag yourself. I'm a coochie beta. They don't make the Mario music anymore? That was a moon? Oh, his pupils are missing. Oh, God. They showed up here, and I'm going to knock the red clean out of them. That's what I'm doing here. Yeah, me. What? Yeah, whatever. Mr. Too Scared to Dig in the Dark. Anyway... Why would, you, why would you bring that up? Why would you... What purpose does that have to this conversation? I was just... I was making conversation. You, you talk a big game and then you're scared. Said, Shut the fuck up. Shut up. We need to air our dirty laundry out in front of this guy. We just met him. We're fine. Anyway, if you... Hey, I was trying to throw Cappy. I was, uh, I was trying to throw Cappy. I am on the complete opposite side of the map now. <laughs> hey, can I, like, no, Mario, don't do it again. So, so Cappy, so Cappy. You become quite skilled at being flat. Was that a joke about my ass? Was that a joke about Mario's ass? Dude, they knew. They knew. That movie's been in development for seven years. Even back then, they knew that Mario's ass in the Mario movie was going to be flat as hell. Non-existent. Doesn't have... I don't know how I did not see that coming. I I was in the moment. I was like, yes, it opened up. Bomb. 
No. <laughs> the completion list. Completing certain challenges will earn you CP. Don't say that. Don't. Don't. Nah. -uh. Yeah, don't say that. Don't. Don't say that. Chat, as always, when you go to the bathroom, doesn't matter who you are, doesn't matter what you did in there, wash your hands. It's just in. Alright. Well, uh, now that I'm done in the bathroom, let's, uh, head to the bathroom. We'll take care of that guy later. I just wanted to make that joke. Hello, boys. Why don't you go jack off somewhere else, you goons? Ow, I, I tried to grab him, I missed. Wait, wait, wait. That guy's name is Kono. His parents literally named him this. No, oh, what's your baby's name? This. This. This is our baby. This. Well, he's dead now. Give me the sign, and then beat him down with it. Yeah, get out of here. That boy ain't right. Okay, where's the park? Uh, over here. Got it. Go into the park. Hello, shirtless old man. That. That's like very clearly photoshopped. Like, like, come on, man. You're not. You're not that ripped. Who are you? Who you think you're fooling? miles from there. I walked away from him. What? I was all the way down here. What just happened? Wh I was all the way down here. What do you mean? I was walking to the park. Oh, wait, wait. Hold on, porn, porn card. Cocoa ice. Oh, oh, that's, oh, that's the. Oh, that's the, that's the girl that I pretended to be her boyfriend. Okay. Well, all right. Then. Oh, I should probably, like, if I want to, like, get all this stuff in this game, I should probably, like, equip that, right? Uh, yeah. Let's... Let's go to the stone for now. To the park! Oh, I was gonna say, did I pass the park? No, it's up here. Wait. There's the ca I thought the karaoke bar was like over here. Maybe not. Oh, that's the okay. Was I? Was I just like not? Yeah, that that's okay. Hey friend, leave your cash right here. Who? Who? Where? What? In the alley? Who's leaving their cash? Oh, there. Well, that's where I'm going, so, uh... What's up, bikers? Uh-huh. Yeah, get out. Yamada-san. Hey. Well, fuck Yamada. Hey! Go fuck your ma- I didn't even catch that guy's name. I just wanted to say that again. 
Hori. Big fan of your controllers, dude. Big fan of your controllers. Get out. All right, give me an iron gear. Sure. That man's all over. That man's all over the front of that shop. Oh, oh, here's the, here's the park. All right. There's a dog. Hello, dog. Hello, friend. I, I wish I could, I wish the game let me pet you. You're so cute. And the cat's up there. All right, hold on. I'll talk to you in a minute, ma'am. I need to go to the bathroom. Which one of these scribbles is our exchange? What do you like? There's where she wrote, what do you like? And my reply was, I wear a suit at work. That's what I wrote in reply. Okay. I like that. When do you see this message? Can you come to the phone booth and show Ucho a rest? Can't wait to meet you. What? The lonely- That's not- It's- it, Man, I'm- I'll have a red nose in my lapel. I'll be waiting. Don't stand me up. Okay. Sure. We'll see what's up with that. Her message looks fresh. If I haul down to the phone booth and show- Shohukucho West, maybe I'll catch Lonely Arena. Uh, hold on, I gotta talk to this woman. Hey, you the person who just knew my son's name? That's kinda weird! Sup? This lady. Right, she's the wife of Akatani, the guy who got his face altered. Have you seen a little boy here? He would have been alone. Oh, that's not good! A little boy? You mean Yusuke-kun? Yes, that's right. But how'd you know that? Uh, well, I actually got to be friends with your boy and played with him the other day. That's a little weird. Oh, I see. Have you seen Yusuke again? I came to get him, but he's not here like he's supposed to be. Uh, I can't say I have. Oh, I found his ball just lying here. I'm positive that he was here earlier. <laughs> that's worrying. I'll keep an eye out for him. Yes, please. I'll keep looking around here. She seems very aloof and, like, not concerned. My dad has gone far, though. If I spot him, I'll bring him back to his mom. Okay. Can I get his ball? Oh, uh, where would Yusuke have gone? Maybe he went to... Like a fun place with his dad. That dog's with that old guy. Is he your, is he your seeing eye dog? Are you blind? You don't have a cane, I don't think so. Oh, that dog has a butt. Okay. Uh, what's. Maybe he went here. In this fun place. They did not go here. I didn't read the sign. They did not go here. And if they did go here, shame on you, Akatani. Shame on you. Yeah, okay. I'm, I'm looking. I'm looking for the kid. Okay, I'm looking for the kid. I don't see him. There's something going on over here. Is that him? Is he over here? Dude, come on! Sutsui? Chopped Sui? You're about to be chopped Sui! Hey, hey, hey! Hoshino? Of the stars? Oh, right in the face! I've never seen that. That was sick.
Anyway, is he over here? Uh, no, that's not him. That's a different one. Where is he? Oh, God. come on! More goons? What did you get out of here? Okamoto? Get out! Okagami! Oragami! Get out! Scratch you in the face. Alright. Hey! Oh, I got hit, trapped in the corner. Hey, man. I want to take you over the cartwheel. I'll take you over the cartwheel. I missed. Curb stomp him! There you go. Oh, I, got, I did get a bonus. It was called Curb Stomper. Okay. Where's Curb? When you need him. Where, where's the kid? Is this just the other end of the street that I was just- This is just the other end of the street that I was just at, because there's the dudes. Hurrah! Who's getting beat up? Oh my word. Could you stop beating people up for two seconds, you goons? I missed him. Get out. Get out. Push him against the wall. Do what you gotta do. All right. And I'll take this guy out. With this. Over the head. There you go. Yes, what prize would you like to give me, sir? A rainbow textile gay pirate! What have I been saying? Alright, I'm looking for the kid. Could you guys get out of my way, maybe? What is- it? Oh Would you- Yeah, get my wallet, whatever. She got Ishi. Down. Uh huh. Oh, I missed. I, dude. Nothing usually is tied to an action command like that. Why would you? Oh, ow. Oh, I, hello? Hold on. Right in the face with that. I meant to throw it at him. But. Yeah, get out. Oh, hi, Bob. Wait, where, where's the, there it is. Where's the, give me the, it's back there. I saw it. Oh, another one for Kokoa Aisu. Okay. Sorry, I, 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 I just really like that girl. Okay. Where would he have taken the, oh, is, is he right around the corner? Or was that where I just was? I'm getting confused about where I came from. Uh, I just saw Bob and I walked around here, so I'm assuming he's just right on the freaking corner over here, I'm an, and I'm an idiot. All right. All right, he, he's probably right here. Oh, hey, it's the dude with the dog again. Okay, could you maybe, like, not be directly where I need to be walking? Bikers! Get out! Get out! That's hanging on his head. Oh, it's spinning! Oh, right in the face. Get out. Alright, took out your buddies. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Right in the belly. All right. Hey, you. There he is. Hey there, you skate goon. Your mom's looking for you. Mister! Something wrong? Some scary people came when I was playing in the park. Scary people? Oh. Yup. They tried to take me away, so I ran and came here. What? What were they like? They were big and scary. They kept calling me Akatani's Brett. Akatani's Brett? Akatani. The guy with his face changed. They're on the... You skate good. Your mom's waiting for you at the park. We gotta get you back to her. I'll keep you safe. Alright? Oh. Okay. They're hiding out up there. Oh, hello, Majima-san. Yusuke-kun, too. Akatani, have you seen your, uh, I mean, Yusuke-kun's mom around here? No, I haven't. I just got here myself. Is there a problem? Well, see. There they are. Nah. Hey, Akatani. Who are you people? Oh. That's not cool. Mom! You see? You're famous for being a lone wolf. No ties, no weaknesses. Wasn't easy trying to find how we could get to you. But our diligence paid off. After following you around, we noticed you talking about taking a lot of interest in us. Huh? Are you out of your mind? I don't know these people. <laughs> oh, then it won't bother you if you rough them up, huh? Mom! Stop! No family history, no friends or others. You kept yourself invulnerable, you stone cold snake. Who would have thought you'd have this chink in your armor? If you don't want to see this bitch die, take that knife and kill yourself. See? If you keep doing what you're doing, our business keeps taking hits we can ill afford. That said, if we got out that we dealt with you ourselves, it would complicate how we do business. So, let's settle this amicably. You go ahead and kill yourself. It's got nothing to do with us, you know? No, stab them! What's wrong? It's a great two-for-one deal. You get to save both the bitch and the brat in return for your life. Doesn't get any better than that. You promise? Sure. Hey, this woman you say you're gonna spare. Who might that be? What? You got numbers, but you take a hostage anyway, and you're too chicken to get blood on your hands. If that ain't the textbook definition of cowardly, then I'm rewriting the dictionary. We hope to keep this nice and clean, but that's not happening. When a job needs doing, I guess it's best to just get it done. Akatani! You keep Yusuke Kone and his mom safe. Uh? Got it. You're up first, you meddling asshole. You're dead. Street thugs. I'm pretty sure they're Yakuza, but that's okay. Oh, he stabbed me. Hey. Hey, bitch. Get out. Now I've got your knife. Oh wait, no, give me that. Sato da. Oh wait, who, how'd he stab me? Who stabbed me? Oh, the, oh, he's shooting me. That's what's happening. Who has the gun? Motherfucker! Give me that. Okay, no, no, you don't get to pick up that gun. Okay, hold on, hold on. Takoyaki break, takoyaki break. Alright. I threw the gun at him. Meant to use it, that was my bad. 
Hey, man. What's going on? Pistol whipped him. How do I use it? Okay, out. Oh, my word. Oh, that guy just bled out. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Didn't realize that was a thing that would happen. <laughs> you took all of us alone? Damn. You boys seem to have the wrong impression, so let me set you straight. The lady and the kid are strangers. That's a lie, and you know it. <laughs> if you don't want to believe me now, I suppose I'll have to do a better job of convincing you. Maybe permanent. I don't care either way. But it's your call, so make it! Ugh! I believe you! I believe! And don't you ever touch an innocent civilian again. If you do, I will hunt you. I will find you. And I will end you. What is this, taken now? Got it, never again! Mercy! Sure can bring the menace out in your voice. Ha. <laughs> it's useful in my new line of work. Mom! Yusuke! No. Talk to him. Hi. Yeah. Sorry I had to go through that. It's all because of me. Y you're the man who's always in the park? Yeah. I'll never show my face around you again. If you could, please forgive me. Mister, thank you for protecting us from those bad people. Yuko, please take care of Yusuke. She didn't say her name. Pardon? You scared. From now on, you protect your mom. You got that? D yes. Okay. Take care. Majima san. Here. This is for saving Yuko and Yusuke. Uh, a Sakura Storm. Oh, it's a katana. You sure about this? Just don't feel right. With me around, my family will be will be in danger. This is how it has to be. Man, is he? Hmm? Hmm? Yusuke, do you know him? No, but... Da- Mister! Do we need to fucking cry? Let's play catch again sometime. Actually, like, making me tear up, dude. Majima 2, apparently. And I think his tears got in the fucking computer, because it glitched. Okay. That was worth it. Hey, hey. Oh, okay, bye. See you later. Bye! Nope, not dealing with you. Not dealing with you at all. I've got like, what, 13 million? Yeah, I wanna bu- Somebody fucking drew tits on the waitress. What? Oh, hi. What's up, miss? Oh, pocket tissues, let's go! Wait. Okay, well, I got pocket tissues. And then... And then I got a porn card. Yuki Natsume. Alright. Cool. Ivy coffee? Don't mind if I do. Wait, I wanna go in. I wanna go... I wanna go into the coffee... I wanna go to the coffee shop. That's... that. That's not the coffee. Wait, is that... Go to the coffee shop. Alright, what's this place? Oh, this place is Don Quixote. Alright. Uh, where was... There he is. Alright, hey man. What you need? Oh no. So screwed. 
Hey, what's wrong? I've seen dumpsters oh. happier than you. Oh, that voice. Hello again. It's my sneakers. The soles have finally worn through. They do look beat mm. to crap. Yes, they were my favorite pair. I can't even go buy a new pair like this. He needs new shoes, huh? I'd give him some, but I ain't exactly in the habit of carrying a oh. spare pair. What am I gonna do? Don Quixote carry sneakers if I remember right. I'll get him a pair if I feel like it. Uh, maybe I should go. Is there a phone booth around here where I could like mess with my inventory or? There should be something here. Where it? Okay, it's down here. It's by those people. No, I don't want to be fought right now. Okay. Oh, this is the oh. This I didn't realize this was the place where I would meet Rina. Okay. Hmm. I see you, huh? It's a dude. Oh, it's these boys. <laughs> Check it out, fellas. We got ourselves a sucker. Huh? We got a problem, gents? You came here hoping to meet a lovely lady, didn't you? Sucks to be you. She doesn't exist. Wait a damn minute. We're the sexy lady you're looking for, my friend. One of you fools is the pretty handwriting? Really? Are you thick or what? There was never a woman. She doesn't exist, you dumbass. Damn it all. I could have told you that, dude. All it takes is the scent of a woman to get dumb shits like you come running. Their tongues out and their dicks popping out of the zipper. You should see the looks on their face when we beat the shit out of them and take anything worth taking. Strangest thing, too. They never seem to go to the cops afterwards. Guess nobody wants to tell the fuzz that they let their dicks do the thinking. <laughs> Pretty goddamn clever, ain't it? No. Oh, it's clever, alright. You finally figure- Yeah! Okay. Hello, boys. I fought easier or harder fights than you, like on my way here. Oh, he's got a taser. Okay. Yeah, get down. Okay, I gotta get the taser out of that guy's hands. Could you stop tasing me, you fuck? Oh, now he's got a knife. Alright, hold on. Takoyaki break! Okay, taser's gone. Now the knife. Get out! Oh, no, G give me that. Oh, he's- he's the ringleader. Ow! Alright, you bitch. Give me heat! Get out! Okay, he was the last- I thought there was another guy left. Ugh, we screwed the wrong guy. We're sorry, we'll stop luring people here with our pretty handwriting. Please take this and forgive us, a calm cow? Alright then. It's a men's bathroom to begin with. Why would a woman be there and they're signing a name in graffiti? Rina, my ass. Wait, a bathroom? Rina? We're running a bulletin board at the train station under the name Mayumi? Huh? What? Oh, screw it anyway. You fools better not ever get up to this kind of tomfuckery ever again. Got it? Y yes, sir. Never again. Can I employ Rena? Yo, Chan, wait for me. <laughs> Serves you right for being some gullible girl. 
I ain't gonna forget this for a long while. Is that her, though? Isn't she right there? Yeah. I guess the man in the suit isn't coming after all. What a shame. Wait. Wait a minute. Ma'am? Ma'am! I'm right here! I'm right here. Where did you go? Ma'am? Okay, well, she's gone. She's gone! Alright, let's go get, uh... Inventory managed. Oh, uh, use the item. But wait, I, I, I drank a. Th I have inventory space. Come on. What am I doing, man? I got the inventory space. Coffee. I got the inventory space. Hop over to Don Quixote and give him some shoes. Hello, boys. I'm just gonna. See you later. Don Quixote should have some shoes. Don Quixote has everything. Don Quixote is like the contact sensitive buttons in uh, Conquer. Alright, give me some shoes. Oh. I guess he has comfy. Can I buy him like new? Sh oh, I can buy him just new shoes. Yeah. And I'll buy him some souls too. Why not? Whee! There we go. All right. Let's go get this man some shoes. I was like, am I go? Am I running the right way? I am indeed running the right way. Hello, sir. Oh. I have your shoes. Give them to Arangu. You see the trick? You gave away a pair of sneakers. Huh? I can have these? Really? Thank you so much. Don't ask how I knew your shoe size. Doesn't matter. I'll put them on right now. These sneakers are great. They feel wonderful. These are the latest style too, aren't they? Oh man, are they cool. I should go for a run in them. It would be a waste not to. Hey, did you forget the whole reason you got into this mess? Think you ought to take it easy maybe? Oh, that's right. I couldn't contain myself. I'm so happy. <laughs> Getting happy makes you want to run? That's a thing? Ha, <laughs> I hear that all the time. I was on the track team in college. Running is in my blood. Oh, I thought this man was, like, in high school. You're a strong runner that I take it. Yeah, I am. But I've been running too much without taking the proper precautions. That's how I ended up injured. Let me guess. You're still running errands. Yeah. I can't stand the thought of not seeing her happy. Oh, I'm keeping her waiting. I have to go. Thank you so much for these sneakers. Okay. But that base will end up hurting himself again. Yeah, probably. Is he... Is he somewhere? Is he at a different store or something? Uh, he's on the... Oh, oh right, there's the, the statue guy on the bridge. Right. Right. Alright, well, I have to go soon. But, I, we did one with Kiryu, and I, I, I don't, we should, I'm, I'm just gonna, we're gonna do this with Majima. Wait, what hurts? Oh, guys, again. Alright. You goons! Alright, listen, before I goon, let's take care of these goons. Hey, 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 
Hey, red sleeves. Get out. Kosaka. Bam. Oh, I have enough. Kawasaki. Get out of here. I have enough monies. Thank you for the pristine skin. I moisturized. Oh, all right. Where's the place? It's over here, right? Down here? Uh, over. Yeah, it's down, it's down here. Okay. All right. Yeah, b before, before we go, I'll, I'm going to turn away again. But, like, we'll get, we'll give Majima one. Okay. Boys. Once again, before we goon, let's beat up the goons. Ikegami. Give me this. Are you, are you coming? Yeah. Step on his face. All right, bottle of mystery liquid. I want to use it. Oh, I broke it. Trash can? Get out! I wanted to... Oh, I didn't have enough heat left after that. That's why. I wanted to see what the mystery bottle of liquid would do to the face. All right, silver plate. Thank you. All right. Here you go, Majima. Here you go. Hold on, my alerts just signed me out. That's weird. I don't... Yeah, okay. Alright, here you go, Majima. Whoa, I clicked out of the game and then suddenly it's in... Maximum FPS? What? I mean, it, you, you guys probably can't see it because I stream in 60, but like, I clicked out of the game and back in and it went from 60 FPS to like, my monitor's full refresh rate of 165. I don't know what just happened. Yeah, I know how it works. Welcome to God Hot, we charge 800 for one of you. Yeah, sure, watch a video. Oh, I have some cards. I have Ayu Sakurai. She was that lady's daughter. I don't need to. Oh, well, there's Rina. There's, you know what? We'll, we'll give Majima what he missed out on there. We also have Ai Haneda. I forget. I don't know which one we picked last time. But yeah, we'll, we'll give Majima what he missed out on. There you go, Majima. Enjoy the video. I'm turning away. He's done. Dude, even when I go to the freaking porn store, just just because Majima missed out on what he could have had with Rina, I get, I find a sub story. Come on, man. Huh? What are you looking at? Do I got something on my face? 
No, sorry. I wasn't right. really... Look, if you want to say something, just get on with it. It's just that you're an unusual customer. How is that? You just seem so confident and stylish. Not the kind of man who might be interested in, uh, our show. And that's why you were staring at my face? I'm sorry. <laughs> my guy like any other. I like to look at pretty girls. <laughs> that's so reassuring to hear. Different as we seem, we're both just guys after all. All of mankind are just brothers and sisters and all that. Well, if you ever feel like you could use some time to relax, just come to our shop. I'll be waiting. Okay. I'm building a friendship with the porn store guy. Yeah, okay. All right, well, we let Majima get his rocks off after that missed opportunity. I'm gonna go to the save booth. We're gonna save. And that's gonna be it for the stream today. That was so many sub stories. That was so many sub stories. I couldn't walk three feet without just finding another one. It's crazy, dude. Let me let me actually look at my uh, sub stories list. Uh oh, I've done the same amount with Majima as I have with Kiryu now. My word. All right. Uh. Wait, does that mean I've completed nine or I've seen nine? I need, I need to finish those two, but. Uh. Oh, I guess I finished the, the doll girl thing. Okay. I did. I, I guess I could build my friendship with her more, too. Uh. But yeah, the only two that I didn't finish were the statue on the bridge and the errand one. But I mean, we're going to be Majima for like at least the rest of this chapter. So I could get those done and also probably find a bunch more. Oh, wait, before before I go, I wanted to I wanted to buy a uh, an ability thing with my 15 million. But which one should it be? Extra bat... Uh, nunchaku swings. X, 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 and Y. Oh, wait, I had another 2 million. Slugger attack. Oh, I had several other 2 millions. Oh, but I, I don't have enough money for, like, XXL. I don't have money for XL. And then one of these. Okay, so Slugger, I have that one. Uh, this one I have Rising Kick. Immediately cover and perform an attack after being knocked to the ground. Okay. I also have Thug Mastery. That's cool. That seems like it could be helpful. Uh... That it could always be helpful. Anything else in Slugger I should know about? Uh, increase the power of that again. Unleash uh, a surprising attack when switching to the Slugger style. Interesting. Uh, well, I, I should buy the heat. I should buy these. Hold on. Let me buy the two health things. And then, I wanted to be, I wanted to be done, but like, I need to look at the map. Where's the pawn shop? Uh, there's the pawn shop. Okay, I need to sell some stuff. Where's the booth? Guys! Get out of here! Get out! Get out! You are I haven't even seen a third guy. Where are you? Oh, he's over here. That's why. Get out! Umeda! 
There you go. Well, I earned like a third of what I wanted there. Or not a third. Uh, like... Uh, that was more like an eighth. Where's the phone booth again? There we go. Alright, use the item box. Give me all the stuff that I need to sell. Uh... One of these is like a platinum plate. Oh, that's a... Diamond price. Or diamond one. Uh... Yeah. Okay, let me organize my inventory a little bit. Can't use that here. Sort. Uh... Yeah, let's put all the plates on the bottom, then we'll sell. Get some Monet. I have the bird toy. Some pocket tissues. You never know when you're going to need to use those. I got all my takoyaki front loaded. And I have fish. Put the tissues down. Alright, let's go sell some sh I gotta use the taxi. To get up there. Uh, where's the... Yeah, up here. Okay, take me up there. All right. Another sub story found. Stop. I, I just, I need to finish this, dude. Listen, can I get you to come over here? Let's just put this weird out. Rise of the Dragon. <laughs> Thanks for coming over. Whew. I'm saved. So what's your problem? What do you yeah, want? The, um... You? Where the hell are your pants? That's why I called you over. Do me a favor. Borrow your pants? No. Huh? Your pants! The pair you got on now. As you can see, I have my Bondan pants taken. Come on now, pal. I'm in trouble here. Nuts to that. I give you my pants and I'm the one standing around in my skitties. You take me for a fool? Aw, oh, now uh Shut up, beep -be. No self-respecting young fellow with a whole future ahead of him can go out in town with his underwear exposed, right? Did you hear me the first time? I give you my pants, and I'm the one swaying the breeze here. <sighs> what a waste of time. I fall for Karen. Huh? Hey! Hold up! Leave me your pants! <laughs> you want them so bad, you can try to rip them off me. Fine, screw it. I'll put your underwear on display for the whole world to see when I... What is happening? Right in the nuts, dude. Right in the nards. I I'm sorry, really. I was way out of line. F fuck's sake, what is with you, man? Explain. From the top. Uh, I'm Toru, and I go to Soton North High. Just before you came by, I got mugged by the Bondan Hunter. Bondan Hunter? The hell's that? Uh, put it simply, Bondan pants are like school uniform pants, but they got high waist and are super puffy around the thighs. The uh, cool kids wear. No, I know what Bondan is. So, the Bondan Hunter attacks guys wearing Bondan and acting bigger than their britches. He beats them up and takes their Bondan as a trophy. So the gist of it is, this guy kicked your ass and left you with your tidy whities on display. And now all these businessmen are coming up and be, you know, are gonna laugh at you. Pretty much. There's nothing I could have done about it, though. The Bontan Hunters is a really weird guy. Weird? Like how? There's something messed up about him. Big guy, but likes to jump people from behind and pummel. And on his back. His back? Oh, great. What's yep. the tat? Nah, he's got this tidy student backpack. Yep. Student backpack? Like from elementary school? See what I mean? He's just messed up in the head. Don't try getting jumped by someone that loopsy. It's just flat out scary, man. He's been going at it every day, too. The way things are going, there's gonna be more victims going pantsless around here. Now, one story Richard is shit to the time of the time poor. This all's got nothing to do with me. Whoa, whoa, hold on now. Please, you can't leave me here like this. Can you get my pants back for me? They say he shows up near Magutako a lot. Bastard's tough, but I bet you can take him. My Bonton's as good as back with you on the hunt for the hunter. Please? Can't think of any good reason why I'd want to help your sorry ass. Forget you saw me. Oh, but... But 
this backpack token guy. Got a Mitsukana Dream Trigon. This is hunting near Magutako, huh? Yeah, I just want to sell some plates. Oh. Sorry. And I don't... Where's Magutako? Where would that be? It's the outdoor mall. Sotenbori East Street, Sotenbori Street, Sotenbori West Street. That's where the cabaret is. Uh, Ganji. That's the footpath. Is that a... Is that a, a place? M store. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's the takoyaki place. I've been there. All right. Anyway, I got guys. The store I'm going to is right here. I gotta go. Would you stop? Yeah. Fuck you. Oh, but I didn't even realize I picked up the flag. Hell yeah, dude. Koga, like from Pokemon? Yeah. Oh, on the taxi? Oh, and then I curb stomped him. Okay. Guys, I just need to sell some plates. Hello, sir. Sell items. Ha! Huh. That's a lot of yen. I just wanted one. That's a lot, dude. Let me buy all the 15 things then, or the two things then. And that one's, these are all 15, but I don't use slugger enough. I want to this one. Okay. Uh, this is more health. Give me that, I guess. Oh, I have to master that more. That's always helpful. I'm just gonna like get a bunch of this stuff. The heat gauge will rise when you adjust your hold on an enemy. When you taunt an enemy. Okay. Yeah, I'll get this. Blade steel. Boost the loop combo count on rush combos. Okay. Let me give some of this to Slugger, I guess. Uh, why after B break guard on enemy? Okay. Essence of the Slugger. Reduces the... Uh, yeah, let's get Essence of the Slugger. All right, so I need 30 for that. And I have 39, so this is the, if I bought those, those are the only two I could get. How many more 15s do I have here? Uh, hmm. I 
I think raising heat would be pretty good. Would be pretty good. And I do grab quite a lot. Uh, but I, I should get better with slugger style too. So let's do. I mean, these help with heat too. Let's do that one. Okay. Anything else that I have? That like I no, I don't have anything else to sell. It's worth a lot. Well, that was super helpful. All right. Should probably do that with key to you, shouldn't I? That was a lot of money. Okay. Come on, dude. I just want to save the game. Get away from me. Alright, there's the statue guy. I'm not gonna walk up to him. I'm gonna save the game over here. That guy looks menacing in the pink suit. Yeah, save, please. There we go. I'll also save over this one just to be safe. And then, do I have anything else in my item box that might be worth money? I have a berserker charm, charm and orange. Grass. A lot of batteries. What? I don't. These aren't weapons. What am I looking at? These aren't... These are food? These aren't wep... I'm... Confused. Something fucked up here. Something, uh... Something's a little messed up. I don't think that whiskey... Are my accessories. I... These are supposed to be my takoyaki, aren't they? What happened to my stuff? My... My... I... The... I... I don't... What happened to my stuff? I have deluxe Tekiri Nabe as my weapon right now. Uh, I... What the hell, dude? Okay, well, on, on that note, that... That's gonna be where I call it. Today. I don't... I don't know what happened here. I don't... I don't know what that is. I don't... I'm confused. I'm very confused. Regardless. Thank you so much for hanging out today. So many sub stories. Lots of fun. I, this game is great. The one sub story almost made me cry. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what's up with my inventory there. Uh, I will be back next Monday, 1 p.m. for sure this time. I'll make sure that my computer doesn't break. And uh, yeah, sorry, I'm just really floored by that. I don't, I don't know what happened. I don't know what my all my items and things switched, but I'll figure it out.
I guess. Okay, bye!